what the skimmy is going on here? <clears throat> this shop looks popular today. Wonder what the occasion is. The cutscene mm. isn't ending, but and I, do, I got called in for work, so I pull later. Sure, dude. Huh, looks like it. What? Oh, cutscene are you even in? If it's such a long cutscene. Hey also, why the fuck is she in there? Wait, what? Why is she not in jail? Hello there, traveler and Paimon. I hope you're keeping yourselves fit and healthy. Oh, cute, totally. You bet we are. So anyway, what are you doing here, Sea Dream? <clears throat> Was that a new animation for Paimon? I take regular vacations in the court of Fontaine. This one just so happened to coincide with a promotion for a new skincare product, so I came over to take a look. I like to keep up with the latest industry developments. It's not a cutscene, right cutscene, but dialogue you can't leave us. Ah, okay, Wait, okay. It's a place where she erases memories of her children. Which oh, so you j at the end, it's good, good. Beauty's on Fleur, and it's run by the Fontaine Beauty good. Association. I've done lots of articles about skincare for them, using the pen name Romero Time Flower. Oh wow! You're a maritime flower? If Paimon's not mistaken, you're one of the leading figures in the Fontaine Beauty Association! How the fuck does Paimon know? Uh, what, what's so weird about that? Everyone loves beauty! I really like this role. The staff at cosmetic shops are always so polite. Well, I guess next I time I, smile on my face, I get my I Emily and I'm good. Well, they sure don't want to make an enemy also, why did they make flower? her so adorable? Like, it's not fair. And I'm not getting her now. And it, it, it annoys me, man. The temple got nothing. Reposo. It's because of Seedwing's love for beauty. Still a leader of the beauty association? That's incredible. The truth is, I study this field because I cherish She's so adorable, parents. man. I'm oh my god, I'm mad now. Oh the words of a master beautician The worst thing is I just gave Ember the basically the build that I would have given um Sea They're kinda annoying. Have fun winning. Thanks winning. Appreciate it. If I had to describe our approach, I'd say it's based on Cuteness. Cuteness. Aww. She's so cute. Oh. Really? Hey, yep. Still, I really value my current. Melusines are beautiful creatures. The They're the pride of, of Fontaine. Be sure you befriend them and cost them more. About skincare and stuff. It turns out my knowledge and experience is pretty. Okay, I'm gonna go now. Have a nice stream. Thanks, appreciate it. A bit sick, so need to rest. Yeah, it's also very late for you. You should definitely take a rest. Have a good night, sleep well, get better soon, I hope, and see you hopefully in your next stream, if I have time. I will appreciate it with rating back, okay? It will happen, trust me. I'm never lying, once again, it will happen. No, I don't mind. I'm not mixed, though. I made a decision to turn myself into this form. A very long time ago. Oh, she made a decision if for that. I didn't know. I could tell you Thanks, you. See you around. A shape-shifting story? Oh, heck yeah, of course we're interested. <clears throat> okay, there was some Once voice line missing. Upon a time. Long ago, humans rejected melazines. Already and movie time. Feared humans. There was one Melazine who became fascinated with human medicine, but no human wanted her help. And there was one girl who liked Melazines, so no humans would make friends with her. So okay. the Melazine became the girl's friend, and the girl became the Melazine's patient. The end. Mm -hmm. Your checkup's all done. You are still in perfect health. Thank you, Dr. Melazine. Dr. Melazine, aww. <laughs> and it's leg as shit. 
Thanks, my stream. Game of doctor and patient, a friendship was born. Then one day, the girl fell ill. The Melazine was the only doctor to arrive on time, but the adult sent her away. Scram! Melazines can't be trusted. <laughs> Who needs animations, anyways, right? The Melazine approached the frightening witch. She begged and begged until she got a reply. If you take this potion, concocted of sin, you will gain a human face and grow human limbs. But then, you will lose everything that attracted this friend of yours to you in the first place. Can you accept that? The Melazine did not hesitate for very long. That's already a fucked up story. On a rainy night, the little doctor knocked on the girl's door. The doctor wore a hood and raincoat, maybe to protect her from the rain, but maybe also to hide a secret. The little doctor held the girl's hand and treated her illness just as she had so many times mm. before. <sighs> Dawn came, and the little girl's condition improved. But the little doctor was long gone, for she knew her friend would never recognize her again. Since then, I've lived my life in human form. Most people who know me just think I was born this way. Poor Sichuan. Poor Dutali. Ooh. A witch? A potion? Why does this sound like a fairy tale? Trust me, it's a true story. <coughs> Who's the witch? It must be the way you Alice. told it then. No. It just sounds so... No, uh, that doesn't sound like Alice. Is it... <sighs> is it the other one? Oh, no. Yeah. It's no, Albedo's mom or some shit. Human form to save their human friend. That must have been a huge decision. Treating patients is a doctor's duty. We must always find a way, even when the going gets tough. Ugh. It's so crazy that they turned you away just because you were a Melazine. Especially when their daughter was so sick. Well, sometimes appearance can be a real barrier. But that was a long time ago. I like how I look now, anyway. Hi, Ren, too! You're super cute this way. She's super cute. Very adorable. Attention, customers. Thank you all for waiting. Now, on behalf of our skincare partner, I'm delighted to announce that our exciting new product is now officially on sale. Wow, well, there we go. Let's have a look, shall we? Oh, Paimon, if you want to buy any skincare products, I'll be happy to give you some suggestions. Really? Personal advice right from a leader of the Fontaine Beauty Association? What an honor! Allow me to introduce our newest skin lotion, Butterfly Dew. I'm sure many of you have already read about this product's trials in the newspapers. To say that it improves skin quality is an understatement. This product gets its name from the way it transforms your skin and makes it glow anew, like a butterfly emerging from its chrysalis and spreading its wings for the first time. <clears throat> we are thrilled to have the inventor of this fantastic product with us here today. Oh, Please no. welcome Mr. Rawat, a researcher from the Fontaine Research Institute. Now, without further ado, I'll hand over to Mr. Rawat to tell you all about what Butterfly Do can do for you. What a nice Thank you. sentence. Hello, everyone. I'm Rawat, and I developed Butterfly Do. Wow, what a looker. Oh, my God. He's a the researcher? Well, wow, he's really challenging the stereotype. <laughs> it seems that everyone is surprised by my entrance. Or should I say my appearance? I'm oh well my god, now it comes. I'm 80 years old. I just took my own skincare thing. Good looks. 
In that regard, I do believe I break the mold somewhat. Of course, appearance is a skin-deep way of defining a person. And yet, one's appearance can be a very real set of shackles, holding a person back in their life. It can rob a young person of their self-confidence when applying for a job, dissuade a young lady from approaching the one she loves. Our actions are at the mercy of our appearance, and we slowly become the very person that the outside world sees us as. A young lady that wants to approach somebody like, but what that doesn't work like that. that those shackles Never happens. Can't relate. If our appearance prevents us from but maybe it's because I'm just then let us first change ugly. Our appearance itself. Who knows? Wash away moles, birthmarks and wrinkles, and they can no longer rob us of our confidence. Replace them with luster and radiance, and we shall never again hang our heads in shame. That is why Butterfly Dew exists. Its mission is to allow us to shed our pupae, undergo a complete metamorphosis, and embrace a new life. Well, that sounds it wrong. Works or not, after that speech, Paimon's already sold. Uh, Mr. Robot, could I ask if you've used this product yourself? Of course, I tried it many times while I was testing it. You can consider me a product ambassador. Wow, then it should work. Still, I don't expect to convince you just by blowing my own trumpet. <clears throat> so, could I get a volunteer from the audience to try it out? Oh god. Who is it? It's it. Oh, Sea Twin. Paimon, <laughs> what the fuck is teleporting? <laughs> oh my god. Oh! Ah, oh, what an honor! It appears we have a giant of the Fontaine Beauty Association here with us. In that case, Miss Sijuin, could we seek your most expert opinion on this product? Um, sure. Whoa, is that a maritime flower? They say she's the pickiest user of skincare products in all of Fontaine. Here you go. <clears throat> Well, it's very kind to the skin, and the absorption rate is high. Even for Fontaine, this is a first-rate product. Oh, shit. Wow, now that's high praise. Now it comes. However. Well, done, Any All right. Well, all that remains for me to say is, Butterfly Dew is now on sale. Damn. Think we should buy a bottle too? Now you're cute already. Aww. Are you paying for yourself? <sighs> of course you bring up Mora. <laughs> Fine, Paimon will pay out of her own pocket and even share it with you. There, does that sound fair? That sounds good. And if you're worried about whether it's the right product for you, well, luckily for us, Sea Dream's here so we can get an expert consultation. I don't think we can fix Lumine. I don't think that there's a possibility for that one, okay? I'm very sorry, I don't see it. Lumine is a cutie, okay? It's an she doesn't need it. To receive such She's high fine. Praise from you. To be honest, I was also hoping you might be able to point out some flaws in the product so I can keep improving it. With most skincare products, the pros and cons only become apparent with long-term use. Oh yeah, this one has instant benefits. Improving skin quality without any obvious side effects. It's one of a kind. Yeah, that Don't sounds worry, though, too good to I be true. Keep using it, and I'll publish regular reviews in Beauté Sans Fleur. You can read my thoughts there. All you need to do is subscribe. Oh, to subscribe. I was hoping yep. for a more casual conversation, but you are a beauty association leader after all. I understand if you want to keep this professional. Sea Dream! Oh, um, excuse us, Miss Beauty Expert. Miss <laughs> Beauty But do you think this product is a good choice for me and her? Hmm? Wait. Are you the renowned traveler? Talks about That's me. That's right! And by her side, the equally famous Paimon. Hmm. <laughs> well, I don't normally handle customer questions personally, but since it's the traveler asking, allow me to make an exception. Butterfly Dew is made for all skin types, so no matter who you are, you can rest assured that it will be kind to your skin. If anything, it might be marginally more effective on Fontanian's skin, but other than that, it works the same on everyone. 
What? Why would it work better on Fontanians? Um, in the interests of protecting my trade secrets, I'm afraid I can't that answer that. That sounds a tiny little bit like. Uh, all right then. Um, discount. Promoted seawater somehow. Save yourself the trouble. I'd be greatly honored to have both of you use my product. Here, take two bottles for free. It's. I'm pretty sure it's something to do with that. What's the catch? <laughs> I can see why you might think that, but please don't misunderstand. This gift is simply a token of my esteem. There's no business motivation behind it. To me, finding new customers for Butterfly Dew is about meeting kindred spirits, fellow admirers of physical beauty. I consider it a labor of love. Admirers of physical beauty? Eesh, that's embarrassing to say out loud. It sounds so shallow. It's nothing to be ashamed of, Miss Paimon. Most people claim to desire inner virtue, but it's still physical appearance that turns their heads. That is true. This is a fact of life. It's only natural for people to desire to become beautiful. And that's exactly what inspired me to choose this research direction in the first place. Nah, be ugly is cooler. Right. Everyone loves beauty, don't they? Ah, look at the time. My apologies, but I have other things to attend to. I still believe it has I'll something to do with Primordial Sea Water already. I look forward to Otherwise, it again. wouldn't make any sense because of the Fontoyanians would have more Paimon, effect I'd on it. There's no need for you and the traveler to use this product for now. Uh, why? Is there a problem with it? The quality is fine. I just think there's room for improvement. I think I could add some ingredients to the mix to make it more effective. Really? Then. Why didn't you tell Rewat about that? Would be too easy. Researchers are a very special breed of human. You can point out their flaws to their face and they won't mind very much. But if you tell them that someone else could do a better job, ooh, now that'll make them really upset. If I'd mentioned it, he probably wouldn't have given you those two bottles for free. Ah, huh, fair enough, that makes sense. If you're interested in the more effective version, I can write up a list of ingredients for you. Just come get me once you've gathered them. When you sure, say more totally. effective, you mean it'll make Paimon even prettier? Ooh, how can we say no? If you really want that. As for me, it's probably time I got back to the Fortress of Meripede. I mustn't leave the infirmary unattended for too long. Alright, see you there then! Time to go to jail. Nice. Never mind, I have to collect stuff. I just want to go to jail, man. I'm supposed to oh with that makes a little bit more sense suddenly oh my god I have an aim that's not good there we go now the last thing, and then I can go to jail finally. Fortress of Meripede, yes. <clears throat> and I have to still condense it, but I'll do that after the story. I'll do the story first. Once I'm done with the story, then condense. I will not 
Maybe it farmed the artifacts. The chance that it makes sense to farm the artifacts. But that's a terrible teleport I took. Is it further up? It's probably further up. Mm, of course it's further up. Well, I guess plotting three times is fine too. I haven't been here in ages, not gonna lie. I don't even know if I have everything down here. There's a chance I don't. But the chance is so minimal that... I don't care, okay? There we go. There's Mr. Riz as well. The infirmary is packed. Please, you have to believe me. I saw it with my own eyes last night. Another me. He looked exactly like me. Got it? Okay. I've written down everything you told me. Now, okay. I have a few tests to run. Take a deep breath and don't hmm. worry. It's nothing to be nervous about. Does this but maybe first, have something to do with the thing? Which finger am I holding up? Your index finger, but I'm telling you, my mental state is fine. I'm not crazy. Very good. Now, on to the next. Hey there, uh, Your Grace. It's Vidua, huh? Ah, it's you two. Indeed it has. I would offer you some tea, but I'm afraid the timing is unfortunate. Duty calls. No I mean, if that's Actually, we were looking something... If that has something to do with the uh, no skincare way. thingy, oh, then... That makes somewhat sense. This inmate came running to the guards in a panic, claiming to have seen his exact doppelganger. A doppelganger? Doesn't that just mean someone else kind of looks like him? And that's what I thought when the report first reached my desk. But we've inspected our records. No one even vaguely resembles him. Considering how certain he is of what he saw, I could only surmise... He's an NPC. He's Everybody looks like him. What? So I brought him for a medical evaluation. All right. Very good. Take a sip of water and rest for a bit. Evaluation complete. I couldn't find any symptoms pointing to a physical condition. I see. So do you still believe there's more likely to be an issue with his mind than his body? I have to assume so for now. Psychological issues are more difficult to detect. At this stage, we can at least confirm that... Make sure you befriend them. I do. Faculties. How's it going, Don? Go Hopefully, nice do. of this gets out. I got cheat sheet. Guards, take as you maybe have seen. A period of observation. I got one gaming. Didn't end well. The Mara Shose Phantom has requested my cooperation on a case. Otherwise, I'd deal with this myself. Sorry for the trouble, head nurse. But I'll have to leave this to you. No problem, Your Grace. I'll add him to my observation list. By the way, we have a couple of guests here who have made the trip just to see you. I imagine it must be important. You probably won't need to add them to your observation list, though. Oh, Traveler! Paimon, it's you! Come back. Hey there, Seadream! It's actually Kay, not that I got important, Chichi. Well, yeah. but... Oh, Q. My office if uh, Q is... Goodbye for now. Q, okay, U-E, U-E, and not K. Because K pasa. So, uh, Seadream... Yeah. Como esta este? Some shit like that. It's something Would you mind waiting for just a moment? I have another patient to see. Uh, just find an empty bed and... Also Dawn, by the way. I won't be long. Fuck you, okay? Oh, sure. Fuck you. Seems that was you. I know it. It was you. 100% sure it was, it was you. I hate you. Okay, don't panic. Let's start by sitting him down here. Paimon had no idea how busy it can get for Seedreen. Maybe now's not the time to ask for her help with skincare. Oh, you're so sure it was me because there's only one mosquito I know. Good point. Besides, it might actually be interesting to observe her at work. Well, this could hurt. So I suggest you take a deep breath first. Ah! Did his face melt? What happened? 
talking to him? It's anyone's guess. His face melted off shortly after arriving at the fortress. But since he's a serious offender, he can't okay. be allowed out for medical treatment. Best we can do for now is ask the head nurse to give him something to manage the symptoms. Oh, this is gonna be awkward. This is face mode. To bring him to the Marashose Phantom for I'm gonna get coffee, then I will be on to you. Them to death. Will that be our fault? The Marashose Phantom? Does this have something to do with the case Risley's dealing with? Yep, it was a huge case. They bagged a few dozen crooks in one fell swoop. By the way, don't. This guy's the baddest apple of the Yesterday, bunch. I was like doing the tier list, right? People. You were not there. And now, of course, it looks as like always. Anyway, up with him. In the middle of the night, at 1 a.m., some motherfucker rang the doorbell. Not yet. I need Imagine. to check the severity of your ulcers to decide the right dosage. Like, bro, what? Don't worry. We Melazines have a very different sense of aesthetics from humans. To me, he just looked like a little kitty with slightly scruffy fur, but still just as cute. Aww. Don't patronize me. Do I look like a kid to you? Just give me the meds and let me out of here. I already missed my cell. Hey, lose the attitude. You dare talk back to our head nurse like that again? Your days are numbered. <laughs> Your days are numbered. Oh, it's fine. <laughs> nah, man. Okay, I'm going to she don't see Twin and I kill you. It's pretty Tell fair. Tell me if it hurts, all right? Look how nice Sea Dream's being. And he still talks to her like that? What a nasty piece of work. Can I leave now? Wow, not a peep. What a brave little guy. Aww. Thank you, Sijuin. And I apologize for the trouble. Uh, so, Traveler, Paimon, did you bring the ingredients? Uh, we did, but we don't want to interfere or anything. You're busy saving lives here. You're busy saving lives. Oh, don't be silly. I agreed to it, didn't I? Just hand me the ingredients. I'm the one who rang the over, yeah. The and then version, you snuck you? in. Take a rest here and if you want. Or stung me like twice or some shit. they're holding a new pancreation tournament in the administration area. Um, or alternatively, is there anything we could help you with, Seedwing? What the Sigma? Exactly. That's right. Let us help you out. It's the least we could do. Hmm. Good point. Kind hearted humans start to develop guilt if they accept free help from others. Don't worry, I'll take a look at my schedule. I'm sure I can find something to treat this condition. I gotta warn you though, it'll be tiring work. So I suggest you take a break first, then come back and see me when you're ready. See, Twin is so wholesome, man. Skibby chat, Omega Riz. Exactly. Rebozo. Dude, I'm so surprised that she didn't say Rebozo yet. yet. But it has to come soon, I okay? The job I assume Edward. it will be in First, like chapter 6 or 7. In this bed. Uh, what for? To take a nap. I need you to pretend to be sick. Okay. Oh, is it that difficult? I thought you did a pretty good job last time. Oh, so you knew. So I you sure knew. Rebozo would be nice. Malingering inmates. When you played along very well, Paimon, I observed you two for quite a while after that. Well, this is awkward. <laughs> but why do you need us to do it again now? Uh, no time By the way, I have C4 Chi Chi, okay? Any second. Please just do as I say. You can uh, pretend like you've got a nasty headache. And throw in some dry heaving for good measure. Uh, okay. <coughs> hey, Doc, it's me. Not at the level of my C5, but yeah, but. Stop pestering me about it. Will happen. So also got raided by somebody that got a C7 GG. So she needs is to worry about you being sick as well. You're nothing. No, I know. Maybe I came I in and bit you and sucked all your luck out. Levels where 
actually join up what luck what do you mean because it'll give me a cold i had a 43 percent chance to win 50 50 i now it got lower so i'm now at 41 probably or something it's always don't do this and don't do that all right sit yourself down and i'll take your temperature oh my god she oh my god she's german oh my god citrine is german citrine is german Oh no. For starters, and we'll see if it helps. But Doc, it's oh, so no. bitter. Do I really have to drink it? I mean, I'll be fine, right? I've got an uncle who There's no way. Cold. She's German. His fever went away on its own after a couple days. Can't you just write me a note saying I'm on the mend? I just need something to keep my mom off my case. Hmm. I sure can. Oh no. Oh no. After all. Huh? Brave? What makes you say that? Well, if you want to rely on your own immune system to clear up your fever, well, then you'll have to tough it out like this young lady. You buy one. <laughs> Hang in there, traveler. I can get a puke. Come on, get to get through the nausea and dizziness caused by the high fever you'll be right as rain after just a few days rest and if i'm not tough enough then you will die hey hey wake up wake up <laughs> put it this way at least you'll never have to see the doctor again right <laughs> you never have to see the doctor again right i think maybe you'll take that medicine after all if that's okay. Oh, of course. Here, it's still warm. Oh my god. <sighs> it's so bitter. <laughs> what the fuck is my money? All done. Great job, you two. That kid really doesn't know what's good for him. <laughs> that's so His mother's a guard here. <clears throat> She's been working back to back shifts lately. But unfortunately, his father's away on a business trip right now. She had no choice but to bring her son here for the time being. He was quite happy at first. He seemed to think that the Fortress of Meripede would be all fun and games. So you made us put on that act just to scare a kid into taking his medicine? That's a pretty sneaky I sucked the 50-50 win out of you. Now the thing is, I never had it to begin with. I, I kind of expected already that I have to go for Emmy. Okay. You had a teacher? But was then again, I built my Ember, which is oh, my siege win. She was human. She um, away a long time with ago. the artifact set, okay? Oh, sorry. And and weapon and all that shit. Fine. Just to check I how really she would like look like. She looks good. So I would say nice somewhat. When I get to talk about her with Problem is just I can't use the set now. Doctor. And since she didn't have a clinic, she go out and visit kind of annoying, patients wherever you know? they were. Dealing with the badly behaved ones was her specialty. I mean, either way, we will see you in April. No, dude, it's fine, it's fine. You know, Sunset, I get Chichi. Lelou said I got Mona. I got a Chichi. You will get the Mona. It's fine. Huh, she sounds like a pretty strict teacher. Oh, strict? Well, it's not how my teacher saw it. She thought of herself as terrifying to kids. Strange way for a doctor to describe themselves. I do not need a C3 Mona. Yes, you don't uh, need a C3 oh, Mona. That's correct. You need a C4 I Mona. Have a picture of her. Oh my fucking god. Wait, is that Madame Ping? Oh, wow. Yeah, okay. That'll terrify the kids. Yep. All the children she treated thought she was a witch. Why does it almost sound like you're envious of her? <laughs> envious of her. Oh, because I am. If she was here, all the children would take their medicine without any need for tricks. The doctor so you want me to like get a three five stars? True. No. You get one from out. there and one from Standard Banner. It's it's that simple. Oh, me on the other hand. And you will get it at heart pity, okay? Which means me at all. 89, That's not 90, because 90 is thing, a flex, you know? and we all know 89 is the true heart pity. Oh, my next patient should be arriving now. Would you mind lending me a hand again? 
Shooting! On to the next mission! What do we have to fake this time? Dozen of patients later. Ah, is it night time already? That flew by. You really have a busy job, Seedween. Well, thanks to you two, it was much easier today. <laughs> Should we get some rest? It's getting pretty late. Yeah, go oh, yourself. Uh, there is one last thing. I have to keep it confidential, so I usually leave it till after everyone's clocked out. Confidential? Are you sure you can tell us? It's fine. You're not living here anymore, so it's okay if you know. All it is, is I have to prepare some ingredients to make healthy meals with. Oh boy. Oh Wait, no. Wait, you mean those, those healthy, healthy meals? <sighs> My patients refuse to eat any healthy meals I prepare in front of them. So I have to prep the ingredients in secret. Then let the chef at the coupon cafeteria handle the rest. Considering even the chef's version makes people uneasy, it really makes you wonder what's in it. Yeah, it's probably not good. You want to find out? I can teach you how to make it. No, thanks. That way, if you ever suffer from exhaustion on your future travels, you can prepare a healthy meal for yourself. It's really good for you, you know. Um, sure. Guess we can help out one more time. That would totally not end in chaos. The ingredients are ready. Uh, now, put them on the table and add them in the order I tell you. First, we add this special slime Blank condensate. condensate. I believe I will hit pity at 77. Three. No. Oh, see that? It adds elasticity. It looks just like tasty jelly, doesn't it? Uh, yeah. Yeah, it really does. Until you remember it's slime condensate. Next up, xenochromatic crystals. You want to crush them up into a fine powder, like powdered sugar. Wait, oh God. are those from Font of Our Aberrants? Are you sure they're edible? Are you sure they're edible? Finally, we'll need some high-protein meat. Frogs are an excellent choice. Uh, you just need to clean their innards, and then you're left with some lovely tender meat. I want to die, okay? Oh! Instead of eating this shit. Frogs. Frogs, uh, hmm? And we're done. All that's left now is to pack them into lunch boxes and hand them to Walsy. Yesterday in the production zone, that's I noticed terrible. an inmate who's been working for two days straight. That means it's a healthy meal for him tomorrow. Seedwing really does have the inmate's best interests at heart. My God. It tastes like shit. That that's like not helpful for him. He he wanna die probably. I mean, I would die. Just thinking about eating this shit. See, you and be like, oh yeah, eat some crystals. I have a few hours till then, alright? Yes. Ah, head nurse. <laughs> Got some extras for me? Just the one today. The serial number's on the lid. Sounds good. I'll make sure it gets delivered. Sounds like they're talking in code. Yeah, talking in code. Thanks for your help. Oh, it's no trouble at all. I only wish I could do more. You work so hard for all our sakes. I'd happily lose a little sleep if it meant helping you out. Uh, that won't do. If you reduce your sleeping hours any further, your health will start to suffer. Hmm, all right. Nurse's orders. I'll do as I'm told. But... You take care of yourself too. Milusines are way too well, beautiful creatures. They are way too Thanks much to part of Fontaine. Seems like the guards and staff here have a lot they of respect are for you, In just one day yeah. helping you with your work, it something like to befriend, you and you, we definitely should uh, cause yeah, any harm. Please, uh, wait, uh, I'm sorry to disturb you this late at night, but uh, I think you'll agree this is urgent. Okay. Somebody else's face melted. Yay. What's the matter? The guard at the observation ward, Odalon, he told me to pass on a message to you. Uh, one of the inmates there, the guy suffering from possible hallucinations, 
well, he seems to have made a sudden recovery, and now he wants to apply for permission to leave the ward. Huh? Already? Hmm. <clears throat> you were right to tell me. I'll have to examine him and make sure he's well before we discharge him. Looks like we've got one job as medical assistants left. We'll come with you. Where the fuck do we have to go? Oh no. Is it further up? That's definitely further up. Sounds sus? It is sus. I can't tell you why. It's probably... Um, not the guy that went into the... Like, has the mental issues eventually. It's the guy that copied the other guy's face. If that makes sense. And he wants to get out of the thing and... Escape the, um, the threshold. It's one raw, imagine. It's Garadushi. Ah, head nurse, you're finally here. I'm so sorry for all the trouble I've caused you, but I believe I've now made a full recovery. After giving it some thought, I'm sure that I was probably just seeing things. It's stress-related, I imagine. I'd been working long hours, so I definitely wasn't in the best state of mind. And that's why I want to get I out totally of the ship. I totally understand. Place. Still, I <laughs> have to give you an examination before I can discharge you, okay? So, take a deep breath and don't be nervous. It'll be the exact same procedure as we did this morning. But we can start whenever you're ready. Uh, again, so sorry. I was in such a state this morning, I barely recall anything. Would you mind yeah. taking me through it again? I need. Oh, not at all. It's a lot to remember. First up, we have a little cognitive test. Just concentrate and you'll be fine. To start with, which finger am I holding up? Your pinky. All right, all indicators seem normal. Dude, so it was a if I would sit somewhere and teach me what in front of me, look at me like this, oh my fucking god. Well, of mental okay. illness caused by Hello. overwork, which is why I carefully observe Bonjour, everyone in the production Monsieur. zone. I wonder how I managed I, to I, I just could not. I, I would swear I have to hug her. Please, head nurse. Give a head pat, left yourself. and right. I'm just still One joke, That's all. Yeah, dude, I can Monsieur. hear you the entire I fucking time, dipshit. Couldn't take it. Thanks for looking after me. Can you not hear me? I'll be as good as new after a good night's sleep. And if you can give me oui. the okay, I know I'll sleep better back in my good old dorm. Monster I don't have a Wii, I have a fucking Nintendo Switch. Alright then, you can leave the ward. I, I sold my Wii. Take two days off I don't, no, no, my brother sold his Wii. That's what I did. My brother sold his Wii. I don't have a Wii. That sounds like a scary so issue. Officially discharged. Nah, it's fine. Great. It's I can't why, would, why, why am I gonna play on the Wii? Uh, Method Prime 1, 2, 3. Of course. Uh, I'm on guard duty in the administrative area tonight. So nothing it's not I use my PC. You have my word. Okay. And I will um use emulator. Guess you finally It's not the same. The day trust now, me. Huh? Is that the same trust me? Yeah, no. Nah, it's uh, you can't compare these two things. I gotten around to making that improved lotion for I don't know. Yet. I feel like I would just use that on emulator. Oh, no right. By the way. Seriously, it's super late now. And you not should go have like the too. most painful Fucking controller to cold probably. No, no, the game like is because the controller is really good. Hope you sleep well. With um the oh my God, motion controller. She doesn't feel like shit for once. We will. I mean, never did to me work, personally. We're both gonna sleep like a log. And I think oh, yeah, for me, I feel like it just kind of depends. If it felt like shit or not. Played a few games with the motion control, and never had big issues actually. <laughs> Switch your room. I'll have to wait until 8 to 12. I wanna die. Next morning, 8 to 12. Okay. I hope this story doesn't take way too long. Something you wish to report? So I can raid somebody. Really like but it's probably lot. taking quite Let's a bit. Go find Four hours. I have to open my OBS anyhow. Dude, today's my free day 
I was I'm just there because basically pulling got scanned. Yeah. Got scanned. And I'm alive for five hours now. Basically, Siege Wing force you, force you to uh, yes. start streaming. Yeah. So, you might need to wait so I will not stream the next two days. No problem. Anything we can do to help? Uh, Depends, I doubt. There's a bit of a complicated situation I thought you could say I'm not going to stream I'm tomorrow. Still getting yeah. to the bottom of no, it's myself. probably two days. You have to believe me. I'm telling the truth. Hmm. hmm. You're in a medical facility. Keep it down. Please, listen to me. I'm not Gascon. I'm Ui. I'm You're a horrible liar, you know that? We get all your mug shots okay, with our arrest warrants. Move. It's clear as day that you're Gascon. But you mean I, because of the I way need I to look? think of, I don't know what happened. Um, I just okay. woke up like this. Then you guys dragged me in here for an interrogation. I brought you here to figure out what's going on. If you truly are the victim of an injustice, yelling isn't going to achieve anything. At most, it'll delay your vindication. All right. I get it. This is nuts. Yesterday's interrogations went fine. And now this. Morning, Your Grace. What's going on? Morning, Your Grace. Remember the case I mentioned yesterday? The one brought to me by the Mara Chose Phantom? You know what? Well, we've been questioning <laughs> the inmates involved this morning. Every single exactly one of them is doing. claiming mistaken identity. Where is my... Huh. That's even weirder than what that guy was saying yesterday. The thing is, none of them have been able to provide any evidence whatsoever to support their claims. Questioning them further got us nowhere. So for now, we've brought them to the infirmary. Right. And we Mostly. thought yesterday was as busy as it got. <laughs> I do, you have no idea. It was so weird. Like, I was doing the tier list, right? We've compiled their statements. I, I wouldn't look. say I was loud of anything like that, right? Missed. And the neighbor underneath us is like deaf, literally, okay? So it could be even that. And then suddenly at 1 a.m. the fucking doorbell rings. I'm like, huh? The fuck is that shit? I mean, this loud? Am I that loud? I asked uh, Sun and Lilu, and both were like not even responding to it. Probably didn't even think that I was loud. No, it's fine. He heard what he what he was hearing was you beating your meat under the table to all the uh, to everything you were watching. I guess. One hundred percent what it was. I had to get out and see the doctor. When I woke up, I was another set unbelievable. I'm a gas gang, I'm wheelless. Today should have been final day of my sentence. So I should have gone free. What gives? Henry. I'm Eric. Why does stuff like this always happen to me? Now there's no way. My release papers are getting squared away today. Laza, I'm Odilion. I'm a guard. I think I was attacked. This isn't me at all. Wait. That sounds really like the Release. fucking. Interesting. The 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 the, the, the face mask of their statements appear to all be due for release today. Hmm. I noticed that too. If that's their plan, they're underestimating us a little. Every serious offender claims that there's someone else who just so happens to be due for release today. And they're expecting us to go along with that. All the more reason to be cautious. Lumberzar, check the release list for today and make sure no one gets processed. We're gonna need an excuse, though. Mm, just say we're out of forms and that we're furiously printing more <laughs> as we speak. I'm on it. It's conceivable that their face swap apps now apparently in Genshin Impact. But it's not an app, it's just fucking skincare routine. So walk out right under our noses. We did consider that possibility. But I mean, just look at them. They match the warrants, period. How could there have been a switch? Mm, only if they're dead ringers for the inmates due for release, I suppose. I Welcome gave back. you that nameless yesterday to assist in your investigation. Do you want to know what my title help? is now? Yes, no. the inmates' mugshots were attached to the list. The first thing I did yeah, was check for lookalikes, and I didn't find any. I'm going to put in Slack like The only like other Lulu thing has. that stands out to mm. me is that their voices yeah. sound a little different. I mean, his last one was <laughs> 3.0. It's not exactly hard to put on a fake voice. Hmm? Oh. His last one was, I think, 3.0. No, no, no. I'm what does our head nurse make ah. of all of this? 
my my title have a way to confirm whether there's been a switch is <laughs> about uh Frina. I know hmm. it's not time to change your dressing yet uh, but please bear with me huh isn't that the guy from yesterday uh, this should be honore he has very severe facial ulcers which require an operation in the hospital at the court of Fontaine. I authorized him to leave the fortress for medical treatment under guarded escort. Yes, like I told you. I'm not Patton. I'm Honore. So there has been a swap. Well, I can see what happened in Patton's case. But how do you explain the other inmates? <laughs> You're not telling me they're... Soul switched soul bodies. Switched Wait, bodies. What? Are you? No. I believe it was their faces that got switched. The method is a bit like replacing a tooth. Take the bad tooth out. You know my friend who um in. has like no one to what actually I think I can what? prove it. But he's to like you. just cracked Farina. Mm. Yeah. Traveler, Paimon, do you remember so, um, Eric from the other day? Yeah, sure do. While texting him, apparently someone can be my one of his friends gave him six with, six K Genesis crystals, the and then he went for to be Eric. one of the two characters. I'm assuming I'll hate them because mm. he was talking about it before. And then he lost his 50 50 to see one gene, and then he went on to weapon banner and started pulling, and then got lost pearl. Okay. <laughs> he fucking so lost everywhere. Eric? <laughs> Happens. Yes, Hedlund. Hello, how are you? Hello, Karen. How's going, buddy? Hope you missed day, dude. I'm good. Then I told him he should have. I, then I told him, in my opinion, he should have just waited for the Serena bear. All right. I guess. It's the cognition test first, like, right? Serena reference. I got cheat sheet, my guy. Um. Now try to recall if you can. I'm not minding too much, but look, I could have had this daughterly, okay? I want that daughterly. I could get the daughterly. I'm, I'm sad. I'm not getting that Mona. Oh. I'll be so pissed if I get Mona. So basically, oh shit, no, 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 I don't last do night the Eric said one, he saw another and then I'll leave the rest the way it is, just in case. Um, if I do get Frina, work. I want some resin to be able did another to test before pour into him a leave. box. But so that time, I'm going she to held up her that. pinky finger. Oh no! Oh yes. <sighs> I mean, she's C4 now. I don't night. mind it too much. I like Chi Chi. To do in the observation ward, so I went uh, but still sad because I my daughter Lee. Security cell. I mean, I, I got the daughter Lee, but I got the well, wrong in that daughter. Case, there is a reasonable no explanation bueno. for the strange events of the past two days. So, what exactly happened? The gang and Chi is fucking adorable. Break out of prison. So they identified a group of scapegoats, namely inmates whose terms were So I actually up. hate you. And planned to <laughs> saying that I'll get two Monas. Last night, when Odilon was on duty, they ambushed Congrats, him Mona. and had one of their groups switch appearances there is a with him okay, using their no, face no way. method. I'm only at that allowed pity them to avoid scrutiny from the other guards. Then, as all the other inmates were asleep, Odilon spent his night shift carrying out what? the remainder no, of their Mona. switcheroo plan. Congrats, Mona. However, they made one no. mistake. <laughs> Henri changed his appearance to match Eric's earlier than he should have done, and ended up being spotted by the real Eric. Real Eric came to the guards for help, but we didn't know then what we know now. So we put it down to hallucination and sent him to the observation ward. Wrong. However, if since I one of the gang members was 50 -50. posing as a guard, they simply you are changed help me real Eric's go to appearance Germany. and had their Eric and take you. his place. And we are going bloodying to kidnap the this motherfucker. Further. And buried right. him six feet because under I while he's Eric still on the breathing. Observation list by then, and no inmates on that list can be that will not work. Mosquitoes cannot fight me. Hence, why that's why I'm getting him to help me. To that little that will not work. Eric off the list. I can one v one him, and you, you just it don't exist. Now. The you see, the this thing is, I just threaten him. I threaten him with well, biting him. I can't fault the reason. Okay. But I'm afraid that we don't have the ability of face switching. You already know the, you already know the, the pain of the mosquito. Criminals altering their facial From appearance night. to commit crimes is nothing. Is that even last night? It was like two or three days ago. The explicit duties of the Malazines and the Marasuse family. You know how many times I, I tried to bite you in the <laughs> We carefully examined all the suspects, and there is no evidence that any means of disguise were used in this case. Huh? Well, then how do we explain all this? 
so far. It seems more likely that Emily massively buff. She's great on quick and two now. Question mark exclamation bar. Actually, who the hell actually runs Cricken? Change someone's appearance. If they use that, what? even a Melazine wouldn't be able to no detect one run, it. No one runs Cricken either. A shape shifting potion? I mean, the thing is, um, somewhat. Me, what's his the auction ass name? Um, Alhaytham. Somewhat. Um, what's his name? Truly existed. Uh, Tachnari. Uh, somewhat. Um. What's his name? Um, Sino. Yes, all of them somewhat. Yes, but all those. Yeah, but all, this, all these somewhat are. Please oh, by the way, I actually still in one hydro team unit, and I actually have a hyper balloon team. At the same time, without any <laughs> but yeah, evidence, but it's pure speculation. You would still lose damage, mm. and with it not losing damage well, anymore, inmates, it would be good. Of switching places, then have a little talk with both sides. Yeah, but we I'm just saying, it's answer. not even a, exactly a quick yep. team. It's just a um, quick that. balloon team. That's what okay. it is. <laughs> well. I it guess. was our negligence that meant we had to come and conduct these post internment depends on you. And I know it's put you out. Oh, the flowers we we'll do it your way. I don't think I've ever met someone who um I paused the releases like you asked. Went we and late. ran a bunch of people already got processed two hours ago with a, a hydro with a just a hydro unit. <clears throat> I checked the list. Yeah. And sure Instead enough, of using, you know, quick it's blue. all the people who gave statements. Two hours ago? That's before today's interrogations began. We're not unbind that button now this second all planned at this Because something pissed me so off. So there really was a switch after all. <sighs> the, um... They really switching, pulled the wool over our eyes on this one. And running mode. We should be able to catch up with them if we leave now, right? I make it like some... Something not random, that like, potion is why? Real. <clears throat> we can just switch faces again after leaving the fortress. <clears throat> and if the Marachose's Melazines can't even spot them... We wouldn't know where to start searching. Okay. Yikes. Um, so we're at a complete That's dead actually end. my fa my artifact farming for today, because I only do one run just to make sure I don't I don't cap before Frina. Well, technically there is one more lead we could follow up on. We were only able to arrest this gang thanks to the help of a researcher from the Fontaine Research Institute. I believe his name is Rawat. Oh. Oh my god, I almost did it. Oh my god, that- I just- I just gave myself Isn't a heart attack. Isn't that the handsome guy we met at that skincare promotion? Handsome? Uh, oh, so maybe shit. from a human point of view. I just remember that he specialized in potions. Oh my One god. The crimes this gang is charged why did, why? with is the manufacture and sale game, of illicit drugs. Why does this game love giving me double According crit to Mr. Rawat, on a fucking they appear to have file. stolen technology he developed through his research and used it in their is operation. Is there any other emblem piece At with double first, crit? he thought it was a typical case of intellectual property infringement, and he tried to negotiate with them. But once he discovered their criminal flat. operation, he reported them you to the authorities. You gave me a flat attack roll. Thanks to his report, a we shitty... were able to swoop in and arrest them all in one go. What a hero! But that took courage on his part. Mm -mm. No. Just no. I'm not using that. No doubt. This is worth following Anyone up on. In, within the As right mind, snitched on no, them, it's highly likely that Rawat will be targeted by right the there. escapees. That aside, since he's negotiated with them in person before, there's a chance but, um, I'll have some additional I information for, for now. Us. Mm. Understood, Frina, I think I would run My team and I will HP, head to the Fontaine Research Institute right away. Cool. In the meantime, please keep an eye on the face switch victims for us. Of course. Feet. Oh, yeah. Um, Miss Morgan, I'd like to come along and help you catch these criminals. Okay, I'll just run overload uh, Alakino. Huh? Why is that? Alakino, where are you? Well, I'm, I'm the one who discharged the fake now. air the last night. Too? So I feel partly responsible. Chev, where's Chev? Um, don't say that, head nurse. Your focus was on the inmates' health, and rightly so. We can't ask you to help with arresting criminals. That's our duty. Um, I also have a more personal reason. Patton is a patient of mine, and if I don't get a new batch of medicine to him in time, his condition will get much worse. <sighs> Look, head nurse. I completely understand where you're coming from. Can I not look at my but arresting criminals character? is dangerous business? And if anything happened Can to I not you, look at 
my character. I don't like how they think None that Sichuan is not capable of beating up some bitches. <laughs> don't worry, I can defend myself just fine. <sighs> you say I mean, that. But still, I think they know she is. If they just I don't may, want her to go and do it if she doesn't Zizhuin have to. Zhuin is the one who raised the potion hypothesis, and I'm sure she has far more expertise on the topic than your team. My suggestion would be to bring her with you. And if you really are worried for her safety, then... Wait a minute, I come in alone. Ah, anyway. there you go, right on cue. Knew I could count on you. Okay. Well, since this plan has the Duke's blessing, far be it from me to refuse. We should head off immediately. Time is of the essence. Okay, let me go to my Ember quickly so I can see what I'm using on her. Uh, let me give her the weapon. LG. I'm guessing recoil? LG. Or is it LG? Oh, yeah. Honestly, LG, I would think would be the way to go for you. Like, no matter what. Because that thing is fucking cracked. I can't see shit because it adds. I would DM it to you. Don't worry. Nice. That's how she would look like. The thing is just, obviously it's like not super, very accurate. 15, 4, 5, 5, and it has four piece Song of Days passed. Mm -hmm. The the healing set that gives bonus damage. Yeah. Yeah. I I'm more curious how much how much HP percent she would have in total. Not because that's because obviously looking much. at because looking at obviously looking at Amber's HP there, it's not that hard. It's it's kind of hard to. The thing is, she has healing bonus on the circlet, because I don't have mm. HP one. Well, yeah, no, that's fair, but <laughs> otherwise it would be quite a lot more. So it's just hard to say. But they. Okay, like, give me a Chlorin. Do I want to try to use Chlorin? I do. I want to just do my thing. I used Alex. I would want to use my thing. I mean, yeah, that's what I did for the first one, though. Greetings. Uh, sorry do to really wanna, No, you know what I'm going to do? I'm afraid we're here on urgent business. Just because I don't want to do the exact same thing need you over to and over and the over. The is a phantom. Right? I'm gonna Let do this thing called some more legal research. Yoimiya. Not this time, no. We're looking for a researcher. And you can probably guess do who is in that. Do you know where we might team. find Mr. Rawat? Mm, and no, it's not Sing Cho. Oh yeah, so Mr. Mr. Handsome, right? Mr. Handsome. He actually doesn't work on site here very often. There's a handful of researchers in the nearby area who know him pretty well, though. You can see what they know. Just a handful? Seems there. Paimon right. figured he'd be the most popular guy around. Well, I guess you could say he's popular, at least on a superficial level. He's blessed with good looks, so he tends to make a good first impression on people. But in all his time here at the Fontaine Research Institute, I don't think he's ever had a single Man, I, I miss conversation you about his research with his peers. That's no way to make real friends around here. I slightly hate all you know, just for ruining, um... Ruining Yoimiya for so me. so weird. He definitely didn't come across uh, for me, like a reference like that product promotion. I can't see why. Oh, I don't find that weird at all. Well, he definitely it's just didn't strike like me as hard the kind of because I'm kind of thinking like, okay, friends. I could use, I could either really? use Yoimiya or I could use tell. Alakino. Must yeah. be a oh, perception my Alakino thing. does a shit ton more okay. damage. <laughs> we should talk with his acquaintances. But we also need to check the research Tell me about it. My C1R1 does more than my C2R1. It'll save us some time. Sure thing. We'll go ask around among the other researchers. Right, you see get C6. Paimon suddenly kind of curious yeah. to know what everyone um, really thinks of him. What's her name? Yoimiya. Yeah. yeah. Is that what you need? In me four, I will put for C6. Alex Chin instead. Wouldn't surprise me. Sorry to bother you, sir, but are you Bertram? Who's asking? Just some concerned citizens helping out the Marishose Phantom with an investigation. 
We'd like to ask you about Rawat's whereabouts, if that's okay. Yeah. We're told the two of you are pretty close. Not anymore, we're not. Turns out we don't see eye to eye. Oh, yeah? What happened? <sighs> the thing about us researchers is, most of us do what we do for some sort of higher purpose, but not Rawat. Uh, All he cared about was how to commercialize his findings. He won't even let you work with him unless yeah. you sign a confidentiality agreement first. Also, he has better control over who gets which intellectual property rights. How are you supposed to get any meaningful research done working with a guy like that? Now that I've got my own technical solution for my compressor, I don't need to work with him anymore. So that's what Rawat is really like. We still like to know where to find him. Is that something you can help us with? Wait, you're... Yeah, I know you. You're the head nurse at the Fortress of Merope. All right, then I'm happy to help you if I can. I respect the work you do. Medicine serves the highest purpose of all the sciences. I wonder, are, is, is anyone going to have wow, any competition with the time on the new banner? The new, is, banner new event? I have no real way of no, I don't. Be. I stopped working with him two months ago, Congrats. and I've barely seen him since. I mean, it would be... I mean, right now I did, um, I'd say go talk to the peddlers. it was like Overload, There's right? So technically, if I would use so. Venti and uh, Fish Eye Chino or something else, it would probably yeah. be the best. Back okay. I was working with them, I Ideally, with them yeah. do often. I want to do it? No. Wouldn't surprise me if they were involved in some shady business together. So I just took Eye like Chino, Beidou, Chivose, Fish Eye, and moved on with that. A little I overheard was well, 52 and 56 or some shit. Pharmaceutical drugs. Like I, said, I did a very first one with, um... Drugs. With, you know, the overload Doesn't he work with skincare teams, products? Which, you know, which, you know what a, that is for me. And then, the second one I did, Yoimiya Ove, with Venti. He's the more grubber, not hmm. me. And, uh, let's just say the first one went a lot smoother than the me. second one. Happens. Welcome. The first one, I got Goodbye. 46 and seconds. We both reach new and on the second one, I had a minute endeavors. and a half. Good shit. But it's fine. It's, doing, it's a minute and a half of Yoimiya, so... It's not bad at all. Excuse us, are you Audrey? That's me. What is it? Are you close friends I'm with making... Rawat? You know what? We're trying I'm to find out where I... he is. Close friends? <clears throat> you mean because I told him I had feelings for him once? I doubt I'm the first or last at the Institute to make that mistake. Why would you single me out as a close friend? I should have known, really. Men like him, they just enjoy being surrounded by fawning women. They're not interested in a serious relationship. Okay. Uh, okay. We were just kind of wondering if you might know where we Wait, can so find him. Who was it that you said you want me to get? At? I barely know him, and was he probably doesn't even remember me. That was supposed to be a get. Supposed to be getting... Shall we go ask someone else? Mona Chichi. <sighs> I think she yeah. knows Mona Chichi better Chichi than she Chichi. cares to admit. It was Mona, right? If we leave now, it might be a wasted opportunity. Maybe, but we're not going to get much out of her while she's in this state, are hmm. we? Ah. Uh, it was she's Mona, right? What? Common among people in love, if that, that's what um, you mean. You're yeah, going to put it, yes. Okay. Yeah. Okay. It's curable? <clears throat> oh, we're still no closer to finding Mr. Rawat. Oh, by this point, he could be in grave danger. D danger Wait, why are you looking for him again? Oh, oh uh, that's yeah. right, yeah! The Marshal <clears throat> Say Phantom said that he's been targeted by some pretty bad people. Uh, sometimes we need someone to make sure she's that safe. Have no, what? Uh, How has this happened? Chivo, that one has he no seemed fine well, when I last saw him, and that was only uh, a couple of days ago. No Chivo, um, and just happened to run into him, of course. Here's the one with the Chivo. Oh, I see, I see. Well, do you have any thoughts on where he might be right now? Okay, but this is purely out of concern for his safety. 
If he's not at the Institute, he might be at his mother's place. I heard she raised him alone, that they had it pretty tough financially, and these days she's housebound due to illness. He makes regular trips back home to check on her. Oh, okay. Do you know the address? I'll mark it on your map. Nope, sorry. Oh. I only found out Unlucky. the thing about his mother because it came up in oh conversation Oh my god, once. someone already thinks I'm gonna get Serena in the afterlife. You know, so I could get to know him better. When I told him I had a crush on him, I offered to help him take That's care of his mother. That's clearly not you who voted. <laughs> yeah, maybe that was a stupid idea, but did he really have to yell at me for it? It's like, fine, I can take no for an answer, but what's with the temper tantrum? Unbelievable. <sighs> These guys only want to show you their charming, well-groomed exterior. Nope. They can't stand it when a few uh, home truths know. shine through. Uh, looks like her love syndrome is flaring up again. We need to find out Mr. Rawat's mother's address. Let's check with the Marshalsea officers when we recruit. Mm. Cool, sounds like a plan. Cool. Ah, you voted! Yeah, just so you can shut up because I want to do my story. Because hey, I know you just get Mona and we move on, okay? What do you want? I'm actually curious who said Farina and Octonauts. We're here to ask about Rawat. Any idea where he might be? Shitty love. We were told you were pretty close with I know him. the answer. Close? <laughs> I'm not sure that's is. the word I'd use. I know who it is. I can check it. Let me use this patent. Huh? It's been Shouldn't a good few days since I last saw him. I don't know, like maybe it's just skill issue, who knows? Else. Um, would the patent in question happen to Damn. be related to the new skincare product he developed? Take a guess. Tch. Yeah, Lilu. kinda. Wrong. Butterfly do, Sorry. or yes. whatever he calls it. <laughs> I heard he made a tidy sum off of that one. Okay. Okay. I'm just saying something straight up wrong. Keep going. Most of the other researchers here focus on mechanics, energy, stuff like that. Oh, I get why you wouldn't be interested in having anything to do with them. Do his, but do I'm his thoughts. Also, codes. apparently the Farina vote is gone now. So why would he refuse to work with me? Oh my God, no! Was... I bought his no. No. And no. it contains a unique substance no. that might have applications no. in coatings no. too. If it worked out, I could probably make as much as he's making. Don't get me wrong. I had no intention of Are plagiarizing sure work. I was hoping Lilu to get a did the second Mona now. My own research. Followed the proper huh. procedure. It was all above board. Sanjus dipped on his on his idea. The license fee and everything. But despite that, yeah, he turned me down not nice. once, not twice, but three <laughs> no, times. No, it's like unit. he's vehemently opposed to the idea. Yeah, and I got the wrong Loli. The kind of money so it's does. just fine. Huh. Are you got the so wrong doctor. Yeah. So it's what anti-social. You got the wrong totally, you got the wrong water. <laughs> the wrong puddle. <laughs> water. I got the wrong puddle, damn it. Water. I said, water. You, I know, but I'm saying puddle. Like because you know where uh, Mona which gashes turns into a fucking puddle? Ah, puddle. I have understood Potter. Uh, I was wait, like, why red hair with Potter? Mr. Antique? No, no, nothing but Harry Potter. Next time you go shopping, you should buy some Beol puddle. fruits. Peel the skin, the of water. In water, then drink. It'll help calm your mood. Huh? Uh, yeah. Thanks. I don't think Auntie well, Bess gives a fuck. Three researchers, let's head back to the meetup point. Now, what do I want? To you know, Hymen started out thinking Rewat was a handsome researcher with a friendly and cheerful personality. It's such a surprise to learn that his peers have a different impression um, of him. I have really nothing to do now. So until <laughs> until now, my time is up. Hmm. A handsome researcher whose difficult upbringing turned him into a profit chaser with a chip on his shoulder? So your thoughts about his appearance haven't changed at all? Well, his looks are kind of a big deal. At least in Paimon's opinion. How does such a handsome guy end up being so antisocial? Even with his difficult family background. It just doesn't make any sense. You can't judge a person solely based on their appearance. It makes no sense. How, Head like, nurse. how's Paimon thinking? Traveler. Oh yeah, because he I looks good, he should be socially good. This is not how it works. What did you find out? Man, I swear to God, Paimon's such a twat. 
Fertram mentioned Rawat's involvement with some pharmaceutical merchants. Do you know if he's registered any pharmaceutical brands? Since he was a whistleblower on such a huge case, I ran a um. background check on him. Hmm. I don't remember there being any brands under his name. How much time do I have to wait? <sighs> How strange. Four hours and 30 minutes. If he was okay, so, so focused on commercializing time. his research, By the way, they explained how Teachwin got Teachwin um, at the start of her story. Brands. Maybe like how she became a beautiful creature? Needed to avoid uh, yeah, scrutiny? part of Fontaine, human looking, part, sampling something. With the gang? So what, what hmm. happened? To make her become a well, part of crime was a witch gave her drugs, a potion because be um, she wouldn't be allowed to be um, helping likely, a sick girl she out because she's a medicine and medicines can't be trusted. So an evil witch Those gave her a potion that will change her appearance a into a more human form and give her human limbs and stuff like that. So she can take care of the child before it dies. And she did it. Mm, if you say and the so. child was like her best friend, basically. I saw him when he came to make his report. And I certainly didn't get the feeling that he was the type to collude with criminals. Perhaps, Perhaps it's now more we know likely how she got that they were coercing him. You mentioned that he comes and it sounds from like a, a poor very family. Thing, so. so, it's possible that the criminals approached him, asking <clears throat> for academic support. Luring him in with the promise of riches. By the time he discovered who they really were... Okay. He was in too deep. Question. What do I do now? They the next, had leverage like, on him, four and a half hours. so he was forced to keep working for them. <laughs> I've seen it happen many times before. That does make a lot of sense. It would definitely explain why he was so unwilling to cooperate with his fellow researchers. No wonder he's so unsociable. He must be on edge all the time with the gang of crooks breathing down his neck. He must be on the edge all the time. Yeah, he's edging case, constantly. The situation could be worse than we thought. Why is he never voting in a uh, working with the escaped inmates? In a non sure to know more about his whereabouts than because us. Because you found him out? There's a good chance they'll get I to guess. him before we do. Based on the information we've gathered so far, he was last seen two days ago. If no one's seen know. him since, maybe we're too late. Two days also, ago? is it really anonymous? So if I can just see it? Promotion. Yes, I'm saying. That was the same day. I mean, the thing he is, I can't. The criminals that's too. the thing. We, can you not I click on it? three votes? Not a good sign. Mm. Oh, I can. Don't worry, everyone. I believe we still you have dumb a as chance. fuck, boy. Since he disappeared right after blowing the whistle. Did you see I who voted for what there, right? Hiding. Yeah. He must have been worried that they'd come for him. Yes, I can. Yeah. All the more reason to find him as soon as possible. They are sitting on the only lead we have at the moment is his mother's house, which you mentioned earlier. See, think you can find the place? Yep. <laughs> when you register a brand, the court of Fontaine requires you to provide a legal address. The one um, Rawat wrote down was in the outskirts of the city. That should be the place. Go to Hoya Play. Okay. No. And you know what I'm going to do? No I'm gonna, to I go to Let's Withering move. Raves. Ew. And I'm going to uninstall Withering Raves. Good. And download Star Arrow. Ew. And then delete Star Arrow after I'm done doing all of that. I got a silver main. Let's go. Nice. Good, dude. I still I don't do... know why I would use him. I mean, I got him I too, do... so it's kind of tough. I will do a... Uh... I guess I will do a um a best run. Why right, wait? Do that. I did one too. It was terrible. Wrong weapon on like Pokumi fucking wounded. <laughs> I don't think I will even build my Silver main for now. I think he, I will build him like in I don't know how many years. Because I have Dark Mage C3, right? With her weapon and stuff like that. I don't see a reason why we use him at the moment. I mean, I know he got buffed, All but right. I don't this still think he's that good. Or that important to her. I'm sure this was the address. <sighs> okay. I'll knock. Okay. So now since it's downloading, I will go and do a random ass run. Seems serious. Well, what's the fastest way to get this door open?
open. Um, break the door down? Break the no, door no. Down? I'll handle it. Let the expert deal with it. There'll be a mountain of paperwork if we damage a citizen's property. Oh my god. Mirusine, the beautiful creature. The lockpicking lawyer. Calm down. Deep breaths. Remember your training. Control your strength. And... It's open. See. Take a few people and lie and wait. Keep your eyes peeled for any activity around the house. The traveler, head nurse, and I will go inside. Yes, I will go inside. I need to change my team for that. Um... Or maybe not. Can you change my team inside there? Would be an option. Or maybe they're just cutscene bullshit. Okay, they won't let me do it anymore. Makes sense. Hello? Um. Anyone home? Oh, there. On the bed, there's an old lady. That's gotta be Rawat's mother, right? She doesn't look like she's in any state to be answering our questions, though. It's Granny. We could try, but she is very ill. Um. We mustn't force it. <sighs> well, doesn't look like Rawat's here. She's the only one we can talk to. Hey, uh, yep. do you wanna? No. Hey, give, give me two characters, right? Give me two characters. Hello, ma'am. Might I ask you about Rawat's mother? We are trying to. I can't play him. those characters. <laughs> you should have specified. <sighs> Can you Amber Lisa. The characters I own. Amber and Lisa. Holy shit! One of them is playable. Of hearing, perhaps. One of them uh, is playable. Does anyone have a picture of a what? I have one here. Kaya. I'd like to show you a photo, ma'am. Is this your fuck son? Man, he's not my brother. Do you know where he Razor. is? Razor. Sixty. Cause fuck him. <laughs> <laughs> he's also low sixty. Stop naming low sixty characters. Dayona. Looks like this isn't gonna work oh, after all. <laughs> Why? <sighs> Why? Well, I mean, looks like we're out of you limits. asked for it. Your problem. I don't give a fuck. If Rawat's not here, Diona and Lisa. Things are looking very bad for him. Is it possible Too physical he could have with the M? It's fine. Because he knew he'd be in danger. No, Maybe. I think I think for the second half but I just so, do. Where do we look next? Like. A and like a maybe we should take another look at the institute. Highly, well, so. it's just I hydro. We all return it's just there hydro now. with Diona. There you go. We found a good amount of useful information mm -hmm. the first time. I think it's the only way I can do the something team and it not feel like absolute shit. This is our last hope. Sorry, officer. You know what? I'll, I'll use your favorite character for a while. Okay, this I'll use your favorite character. Some the, no, the character Fisher. you want me to get, of course. Oh. The no, 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 the character you want the head me to get. Mona. Not You're technically here as her yep. assistant I'll after use Mona. all. Mona's ass cheeks. Also, so I'd like some Marsha say members to stay as well and keep an eye on the area. Some Was sort that? of a... If her wife knows how serious his mother's I don't condition want to, I can't is, do hyper -room really, he will return. I have... Earlier I was upgrading an artifact solo leveling. You know, the one, the shoes that I had. And keep a lookout. With crit rate and attack percent sub shit, right? Mm -hmm. It rolled yeah. defense pen on last set. It rolled defense pen uh, one more time or two more times or some shit. And one time crit rate. Well, heck. That thing is so fucked correct now. I, <laughs> oh I, put, I put it on my dark mage. Yes. She got like 1000 crit damage or some shit. From it. Let me take care of a few things first. Could you pass me the towel over there? And the defense pen yeah, scales course. like crazy. It's like 1200. Um, Per um, subset or some shit. Per subset roll. It's fucked up. Or the last one at least. It was like a 2000 and then rolled 1200 or some shit. It's absolutely nasty. I can tell that her family has tried a lot of different treatment methods. Including and it's even on set. On the 73 um, level set. Her condition is so multifaceted that a recovery looks all but impossible. See, Dream. I'm on bets being a nurse must be pretty tough at times like this. Come in, Chad. Yes. It makes me a little sad. 
In Melazine's eyes, the human's birth, aging, sickness, and death are as much a part of natural law as sunrise and sunset. But human medicine can defy that law to some extent. In that sense, it is a science of miracles. That is why I became fascinated with it in the first place. But it was only after I truly became a doctor that I realized miracles don't always happen. Even the greatest doctors cannot cure all diseases. See, Dream. It's fine, you are Don't our best doctor. Me, Fuck by you, you piece of shit. Not to cure all diseases, but to treat whatever ailments they can. At the very least, I can lower her fever. That way she'll suffer less. And she might even be able to see her son. Yeah. All the more reason to find Rewat as soon as possible, even if we don't catch those crooks. Okay, I'm back. <coughs> Welcome back. Back. Her fever is getting worse. Could I don't I know what I'm going to do for the force team. Fuck. Sure, we're on the case. If I had Farina, it would be a lot easier, but I don't have Farina. The drunk source has been riffled through essentials. Couldn't read all that much in time. A map. Oh. Okay. Interesting. Check the frame. And how am I supposed to do this? Holy shit. Found the hot water? Sure did. And look what else we found. Judging by this journal, it seems like Rawat has a private lab. There's a good chance he could be there right now. We gotta go you tell what? Officer Morgan right away. As well. What? I am gonna That's use a favorite news, But good hold good. on just a moment. The wet towel is ready. I'm giving you another injection. Are you feeling better now? <coughs> Sounds like a yes. It's all right. We'll what? Go I'll bring use Yao Yao too. Please hang in there. Just to press Q. Thank you. For like two seconds. So basically, in all actuality, she doesn't exist. <laughs> Maybe I should have opened the map, but I don't think I can do it from inside. Do I have enough pieces on a structure for F actually? One, two, three. Uh, no. Oh my god, I'm one piece off to have enough for instructor. Okay, I guess I have to run four piece. Oh my god, that's yes. the cutest thing I've ever seen. Oh my god. Actually, you know what? What? I really want to try and see what happens if I try to use overload Lisa. <laughs> Dude, look, look, look at this. Um, so fucking adorable, okay. man. Whoa. <laughs> no, don't look this way. I'm supposed to be hiding, remember? Captain's orders. Like her, her fucking head and let's call it ears show and she's like, I'm hiding. Please go away. It's so cute, man. No, you're gonna give me away. I'm just saying that Mew these are just absolutely beautiful creatures and the Pride of Fontaine. I'm curious, do you think um Yes Do you think Fisher and yes. Lisa can do the force half by themselves? Probably not no. <laughs> oh god. Officer Morgan! They're already here! I want my Chevy! Nice. Good luck on that. We came as soon as we heard the news. 
fucking delusion, man. I can't <laughs> believe we were so careless. The most crucial information of all was hiding right there, in that room. And we missed it. Um, my Don't Chevy? Don't blame yourself. Right now, Here we need is. to focus on she finding a way in. No glass this time. There's a mechanic. Okay, now I have to change my team to put the instructions um, in the journal will Furina in team. It. So Furina, Fischer, each one and who else. So we're gonna take... Um... Nahihi. Yeah, I was thinking Dato. about the same. Dato with Dato. And then, put, and, then, and then putting Let's Flea. No. Dato. Dato with Freena. Dato, Dato take... Um... It's just Dato taking, um... Acting lessons. That's what it is. Okay. That's why. That's why you should do it. Her Fisher. Where is my? The thing is, I need a f fucking fifth character, which is problematic. Mm hmm. I mean, I got a cheat sheet, so I'll take a cheat sheet. It's fine. Again. Lost 50 50. It's fine, you know, it's fine. It's just it, it just a chi chi. Everybody's happy. <clears throat> I mean this first thing is not gonna work out. I don't think I I, I don't think I try to use Lisa. How about if I try to use beta for four staff? No, Lisa. Just, just... How did oh, they get God, in I'm here? Captain, up ahead. Those look like our fugitives. So they found this place too? Maybe if it was Don't let any of them escape. Maybe. That kind of fucks up the same team. Minute's memory. Dude, Siege Man is good, man. Like. I just see Furina's HP being full HP, and I'm like, oh my god, it's not even mine. It's just a random ass trial bond. Shitty. Captain, according to our list, many of the fugitives aren't accounted for. There may be others hiding deeper inside the facility. Ah, so these guys were just the lookout crew. What? The Mara Chose Phantom. How did they find this place? Wait, well, maybe I use Venti. It's that guard from the fortress. I probably use Venti. And mm. called today. That's right. I'm on your side. Uh, I mean, Diana? the Duke sent me. Is. What's the matter? Uh, Some sort of mix-up? I'd make sure Lisa's built. Mr. Odilon, sure didn't I, mean, I tell you a few Diana days ago that you need to stop all field work never until you recover? Ah, uh, well, you know, gotta help his grace out. Share the load. <coughs> Officer Morgan, this man is an imposter. The real Mr. Odilon has no recent health issues. The other ones for us. What? HP. But I. <sighs> Looks like the head mm, nurse was right yeah. about the face swapping method. Okay. Arrest them all. Arrest them all. Hey. Dupont, hey. stay here and keep guard. And watch the exit. If we're not back soon, call for reinforcements. Got it. Mr. Leila's for now. Nice. Which at the end of the day is supposed to be my um, Okay, Farina. this the siege win of the story, okay? 40,000 HP. Uh, uh, 57 crit rate, 92 crit damage, 135 ER. No hydro damage, Kirby. She has hair bow. She has hair bow. Okay, really good. A 1 level 90. It's... As always, the fucking, um, what's it called? Noblesse set. C3. So I have the OP C2. That's pretty fucking damn good. And yes. C3 damn. Yeah. And C3. It's probably level 88 talents with. 8, 11, 8. 8, 11, yeah. 8. Yeah. Oh, fuck. Hey, 
um, stay on it, you're fine. I wish I had LG, just because that could throw it on you, but... I don't have LG. <laughs> don't slip and fall. Um, and then Mona needs to get ready to be a main DPS. Which means I either... I'll take... I want more battles for Dota piece. me. So many jars. Um, Was this some sort of production facility? Wanderer's Troop, I guess. Scent. It's probably the ingredients used to make butterfly do. I don't think there's much reason for you to go for any of the other... I mean, I have Hunter, but of course, no Fina yet. Did it sell so well that he ran out of supplies? They are broken, Paimon, that's why. <laughs> How strange. Why would Rawat choose to manufacture mm, a popular product was, like, like that in such a anything. difficult to reach location? And I would have been more okay with it. Given our suspicion that he may have been coerced into the illegal drug trade, I would have thought that any production facility we find here would be used for illicit purposes. <laughs> Perhaps Butterfly Dew is itself an illegal drug. Do you have any evidence for that claim? No, but it makes the most sense. No, just a guess. We need to find Rawat as soon as possible. Uh, he has all the answers we need. High Understood. Bonus. Well, let's not linger here. Let's go. Come on. This one makes the most sense. We do this one. Seventy to two hundred one. But the thing is, my ER is only 154. Holy shit, that's low. I'm not gonna collect these ER so low. Holy shit. Of who? My Mona's ER. She's, oh. She has such a low ER. Happens? 155. 155, what the actual fuck? We see less and less of the source fluid. Is it because of the flood after all, at least? Scratch, 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 okay, okay. Oh, that's fine, I guess. She'll live. And then, of course, last pair of the two sacred friends. Um, Mona, sing. Doesn't look like we're gonna get this door open. Let's find another open. way around. Sing Cho. I can find Sing Cho. And he should be fine? Yeah, he's good. Tinko then see I mean is good hmm. from What's with those cards and traps? Event. Oh, maybe it's and one of those doors that least, opens when it senses cargo passing have, through. No, um, There's a I loaded card right over there. Let's bring it that. to the door and give it a try. Um Nikita Ya Yelan, not Yai. Uh, interesting with my Yelan, so she has more balanced stats. There's a chest laughing at my face, and I don't like that. I mean, I would laugh at your face too. Let's blow bubbles! Let's blow bubbles! Give me that back, and... Go. I'm coming back on this. Uh, meet Elon. 79 yeah. What? Dude, Citroen Seed is not bad. I mean, I would figure it's pretty good. Yeah, who could have guessed? I mean, she she's a healer, so... It's team-wide. Guess what? That's pretty good for Farina. Clockwise, yes. Get the card moving. But okay. Yes. The last character I need to look at is Lisa. And I think I give her TTDS since there's not much voice for me to go on anything Afrikisu. else. Also, 
buff. Uh, what's my name? No, oh, that's just giving me an idea, actually. Oh wait, no, mind, no, it's it, it's on the other team. Yeah, never mind. Makes no sense. You just remove everything here. Um, Lisa probably is gonna wanna want as much EM as possible. Nice. There's some little puzzle inside Siege Wind Domain. Nice. It's not really something you can fuck up badly, but at least something. Yeah, then watch people still complain. Probably. I guess four. I'm gonna go four piece emblem actually. Fuck it. I think I'm gonna take mostly just Zhang Ling's artifacts. Yeah. It seems like the most, it makes the most sense because you know, high, high EM, high crit, and high ER. Like that's the uh, main idea, the main focus. Okay, but I know I want to take this one. No, not that one. Where is it? This one. I want to take this one. This room's much smaller than the others. Uh... 3, 6, 11, 21, 13, Judging 16, by the implements 16, on the table, this looks 14, 16, like a potion making uh, yeah. lab. Sorry, Venti. Uh, head nurse, over here. Of course, I can take a electro goblet. If not, EM. One to two. Let's see. Huh? Well, that's close. Electro Why would he change here? To escape, Paimon. To escape. Perhaps they stripped him down, left the clothes behind, and disposed of him somewhere else? Yikes, Steedween, where did that come from? Oh, what a tragic way to go. Especially with such a bright future ahead of him. Further on, Officer Morgan. Let's keep up the pace. Let's do something quickly. Maybe that makes my PC somewhat a little bit faster. Because right now I feel like my PC is like fucking dying. That's right. Is the game lagging? Yes. It's my tap and see that legs. Would, uh, I would I would run this circuit on Nahida is just that I would need everything else to be on equal and on set and actually decent. At least. It's definitely on my side, Karen. Which annoys me the fuck out right now again. Where's my Lisa? <clears throat> hmm. Who's on the first? Uh... Dude, I don't really need an attack buff, I guess. So it's not that important if I swap her off into something different. So she has better value. Nice, I got two premium jimmies. I'm rich, bitch. Uh, you know what? I'll take Witzer. I'll take the Witzer. I think guys would say 42 to 1 to the Oh my god. That crit ratio is horrid. It's not even bearable. Don't slip and fall. I mean I should get now to the end fight. Which hopefully shows a little bit more C twin action. Shh, That's so cute. <laughs> That fat boy in the back, are that's serious? probably the guy, would surprise me. Day, our faces are going to rot like yours? Pontanian physiology changed dramatically after that great flood, and it's not as compatible with this face-changing solution as before. The side effects are as you can see. 
Why didn't you say anything before we all used it? No, that's fine. Look, my plan got y'all out of prison, didn't it? You'd have much bigger problems to worry about this. right now if the Marshall Say Phantom found out about your other crimes. Consider an ugly mug getting off lightly. Ugh. You're just lucky we didn't leave you in there now. after you disappeared on us with no warning. We only let it slide because we're this and not want to. And now this you have the gall to call stuff like this? Bridge. Partners, make no mistake. Each of us is only looking out for himself. If you place too much trust in others, well, I'm afraid that's your problem. You hid things from me, too. Remember how you each had a spare potion? You kept quiet about it until we planned the prison break? Oh, and you didn't have a secret spare? Then do you want to explain how you melted your face off before all this? Guys, that's enough. Calm down. Oh my god, Nikita's broken as fuck. Is. Holy shit. Arguing won't change anything. What's the plan, Parton? I'm assuming you brought us here for a reason? There is no plan. We follow Why is Nikita so the broken? Of more juice. Because she is. Turns out, there ain't a drop here. It's a power of daughter. What does it matter now, anyway? He already said. Even if we it's so get broken. More of that stuff, then me playing Lisa on this team doesn't even feel that nothing. bad. They're still gonna melt off eventually. Because I'm using I more as a I said enough support. arguing. Potton, tell us the plan. <sighs> the so most practical you want, solution is to kind of continue using the potion. Bad. Keep switching to a new face before the ulcers can start forming. Are you kidding me? This stuff was hard enough to get a hold of even when we had a supply. Now you're asking us to use it like skin lotion. After the flood all but wiped the supply out? Well, there is another option. But you'll have to make a deal with me first. Okay, now we're talking. What's the deal? I have a document I took from that researcher that details how to make a replacement. Just give me one bottle of the undiluted fluid, and I'll get to work. Wait, you uh, know what's funny? What's no, it's uh, as fast I thought you as kept me reserves. playing Ganyu for time. Or do you really just have Not one just surprise? Each? What do you think? That we were shipping them into the fortress of Meripede by the basket load? How of Nahida? Well then... Say hello to never showing your marred faces in public again. Ugh, I've heard enough. Get him. Let's see if that document even exists. Nice. Diana wants to make fun of you. And call you Freeze. a doo sound. Marshall say phantom. Freeze. Marshall say phantom. What? Who let them in? Fine. Shake a hamster. Officer Morgan, before anything else, please find out Rawat's status. Rawat? I don't see I'm sorry, him. Diana, but yes, I do think I can bully you. Hand over the hostage now, if you want any chance of avoiding an extension to your sentences. <laughs> Spare us your condescending attempts to coax us back to our cells. You think we're looking to negotiate? Rawat is dead. But... No, he's not. Arrest them all! Don't let anyone get away! Nice. Damn. I can be a My bonus is Dude, I fucking want Citron, man. She says wibbly bobbly, man. I have to. Midnight phantasmagory. Oh my god, Melody! Let the balls collide! <laughs> Gotta say, I never expected to see the head nurse in combat. Some patients respond better to a more mm. aggressive hey, so treatment does not plan. Feel that bad. We it does not everyone? feel as bad as I expected it to. Captain, we finished the head count. Potten's missing. Over there! The door is closing! I expected it to not feel that great, but... It feels actually perfectly fine. One group trying to arrest me, the another trying to hunt me down. Good. I gotta Not kill two Dothra, birds with Nikita. one stone. Uh, how did he get up there? If there you're gonna tell me it's, it's Dothro instead of Nikita, I'm gonna tell you to Find go it. and do a bit with Don't waste with your energy. Kui. I already sealed it off. How naive. We have more people outside. If we're not back out by the agreed time, they'll come to our rescue. Well then... You'd better hope they get here in time. This bitch is broken. Except kind of she's not a bitch. Oh, be careful. 
It's poisonous. Nice poison this gas. This is our distribution center. As a German, I know I solution. should not use that. We had to use special fire prevention My gas tanks? to prevent contamination. No poisonous I gas. It's like um. It's designed to emit yeah, there was a thing yes, in guessing. in World War that was like used, which is not that nice. No, it's fine. It's fine. You can use it. Why would fine. you do this? Your partners are here too. You're fishing for no, a reason, please. right? If they can't supply what I need. They're of no further use to me. Besides, I can't. It's have not honestly. It's not even bad if I drive with Lisa. He's a maniac! I thought it'd be a lot Come worse on, if I tried to drive with Lisa, but I just did it and just not feel that bad. Go ahead, struggle in vain. Once the last of you croaks, no one will ever find me again. So long. Are so you long. Sure you're ready to leave, Potten. You haven't changed your dressing today. You can't cure my face. Just give up. And uh, no. What if I could? Die, die, die. <laughs> nice try. You're just trying to stall me. Don't you worry about me. I'll find a way to cure my face once I get out of here. Yeah, the fat. Oh, I doubt it. This fat fuck is the saucy no. one. Hundreds can no longer dissolve in primordial seawater. What? I, what? What the? I, how? How did you? The key component of the face changing potion is the fluid left behind by the HP is going down so slowly. It might look like and it's not even Mona's fault. It's just it I have nothing to do. I have no reactions or anything. Mona is just trying to do her thing by herself, speaking, and it's not helping. A potion made from that fluid could dissolve and reconstruct the face of a Fontanian in much the same way as Hydroidolins change form. Theoretically, it could give someone any appearance they wished. But since the flood, Fontanians have become true humans. They can no longer provide the source material for this potion. Fontanians are no true nor humans. Nor reap okay. its benefits. You know what's kind of you know what's are stupid? You um, this so I know you most definitely is made from Fontanians this. When people complain with about the uh, Unbano, how the Abyss and their crimes are wants far to cater towards the Unbano character. How could you know all of this? No, wait. I don't see why people get pissed at that. <laughs> of course! Well, well. So that's why you have a human appearance. It also means that I have a formula you're unaware of. <coughs> the air's getting thicker. It's getting hard to breathe. I might get to make a deal today after all. All right, keep talking. How do you intend to give me the formula? Oh, it's not a formula, but a finished product. I have a bottle of it right here. What? When I tried Rawat's skincare product, I noticed it had a certain special component in it. So I had my friends gather some other ingredients for me, and sure enough, a little one case now, uh, later, not not I for that the long. I have to hold. I'd rather I'm just auto attack and make it the okay. It's literally a waste of my time. Huh. Impressive guesswork. Yeah, we were a supplier for some of the raw ingredients, <gasps> but it only contains a tiny amount of the active ingredient. The effect is minuscule compared to the undiluted fluid. Reverse the dilution process, giving the skincare lotion a similar effect to the fluid it is derived from. Impact. That's impossible. If I tell you some of the ingredients, I think you can figure it out. First, you need to combine tinctured hydro phantasm tissue with transoceanic pearls at a ratio of around three to seven. Tainted hydro phantasms and transoceanic pearls. <laughs> I see. I can't believe I never thought of that. So, can we make a deal? Sounds good to me. There's a delivery pipe underneath this window. Drop the potion in, and I'll release you all. Nope, not trusting you that easily. You're like those naughty kids who try to hide their illness. Open the sluice gate first, then I'll hand you the potion. <laughs> Even if you're not bluffing, your potion won't cure my face permanently. You really think you have any leverage here? 
I'm not closing the valve this time. Clock's ticking. Fine. Then I'll just stand here with the potion in my hand. And when I faint from the poison, I'll drop it and it'll it's be destroyed. It's just my second team. It just doesn't feel like no. it. Fratini and shut. Ooh! Keep jumping! Disable that sluice gate! Do I have Cherish Boys even? Don't let it close again! Apparently I do. That's more like it. In that case, do I have any? A promise is a promise. Nice, I apparently have one. Head nurse, there's too much poison gas in here. We have Where to leave now. Where is my Kuki Shinobu tea? Challenge completed. Nice. <clears throat> well, second. Uh... Let's hope I'm not getting another animation because my PC will fucking die. I mean, it's already dying. Also, be back a second. All right. I think ours makes more sense. Ours would do more damage. And last but not least, of course, I need <sighs> the character that... That was too close. That button is a real nasty piece of work. Oh, don't be too quick to sit down. I don't know how much Moving I missed, but I don't think I missed too much. But I'm back. Same goes for you, traveler. Oh, but Paimon, um, you missed me fine, deciding right? to replace Venti on the second Fly half fast with is pretty uh, tiring too, actually. And... Anyway, now it's gonna go to hell, right now. So. I'm still shocked to learn that there's a whole criminal right, operation going on right. behind that skincare lotion. Shame I ended up giving the improved version of Potten after finally making it for you. I'll make you some more. I promise. No, 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 please don't. Paimon doesn't want to use that stuff anymore. Still, it was a pretty good job that Paimon wanted to buy some in the first place, huh? It ended up saving everyone's lives. That's gotta count for something. Which one was the one doing the saving? Yeah, yeah, Paimon was just kidding. Head nurse. I've done a final head count of our <clears> team <throat> and the criminals. Everyone's here and doing fine. We're ready to escort the fugitives back to the fortress of Meripede. It's a shame that we didn't find Rawat. Dude, that fat cop? He's point, for 20 years already in that fucking picture. Deceased. Nobody thinks about <sighs> him. What a horrible bunch. Especially that Patton guy. If he hadn't made good on that deal, we'd all be dead because of him. <laughs> no, we wouldn't. I always keep a whole bunch of antidotes on me for emergencies. And one of them neutralizes that poison gas. We'd have been fine, even if he hadn't opened the gate. What? Then why did you give him the potion? If this is true, I must concur. <clears throat> Sorry to be blunt, but I think you made a bad decision by handing him that bottle. If he changes his appearance and flees Fontaine, it's unlikely that we'll ever find him. No matter um, how cooperative she never said are, that the potion can still no, change you the don't face. understand. I gave him the potion precisely so we could be sure where he'll go next. What do you mean? Oh, we gotta hurry. She won't last much longer. Also, the fat fucking cop for the fifth time, twentieth time, two billionth time in the background. Dude, he's so fucking sus, man. Fat cop in the background is so sus. Dude, Why no, you, you have. Fat? Dude, no, you have no fucking idea, dude. Fashion. Like, it makes no sense that there's a fat cop to begin with, okay? It shouldn't be. Straight up, okay? Then, yeah. he's like always in the fucking background, no matter what, and so annoying. I'm just Ben. Yeah, But just before you came up. Yeah. Like, just, just before. Yes. Huh. Yes. He said, yes. Are you evil to be the hmm? Are you evil to be the <laughs> 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 I'm trying to. I might be short, but I've packed a mean punch. Oh, you're trying to get me to come out of the game? While I was lying in wait, I you saw this slow? crook snooping around, no, trying to find a way in. Cold. So I detained him. <laughs> oh, his face. Are you? How much are you? Potten? Licking that. So this is where you were heading, huh? What? 
This is how Potten looked before his face was marred. His current appearance matches the mugshot on his arrest warrant. Mm. I see. Wait, so what's going on? Wasn't the whole point of the potion to disguise himself and escape Fontaine? Why would he change back to his original face and run right into our trap? Enough of this nonsense. Let me in. You better pipe down. There's an old lady in there who's very sick. No way are we letting a crook like you inside. <sighs> Let me read. It. Listen to me. I'm Rawat. Maybe this helps. That's my mother maybe in I there. For the fourth half. And maybe I'll be fine. He's gotta be lying, right? He's not lying. was a victim in all this. He was forced into it against his will. How can he and this monster be the same person? I can try to... Forced against his will. Oh, man. Mona's gonna have to put in a lot of work this time around. <sighs> That's the funniest thing I've heard all day. Heck, when I was being coerced, everyone thought I was colluding of my own free will. And then when I actually became a criminal in my own right... You all suddenly thought I must be under duress. <sighs> Amazing what a difference a handsome face makes. Save us the speech. Explain yourself. You want an explanation? Fine. I'll tell it how it is. When okay. I was just pot. Nice. My my Hawkeye star. My star was always done. So. Okay. I, I'm gonna try what to do, do this want? one more time. Get away from me. Like, it's not Lisa's fault. Women despise me. Collaborate? <laughs> you don't look like much of a researcher to me. My peers scorned me. Mr. Potten, was it? I'm most interested in your research. Consider my offer carefully. I doubt you'll find other investment opportunities. Only villains would work with me. You want out of the game? Forget about it. Turns out, I slipped up a little. Left your picture with some Mara Chaussee Phantom officers. Easy mistake to make. Now they've listed you as an accomplice and drawn up an arrest warrant. So I suggest you put any thoughts of running away in arrest. If you get caught by the guards for being in the synth business, you ain't ever seeing the light of day again. <laughs> That's kind of fucked up. There was no way out for me until I could stop being potten. Mr. Rawat, I... <laughs> um, I have something I'd like to tell you. I became popular with women. This new potion you developed is fascinating. Genius, in fact. Would you consider working with me? I'd be happy to sign a licensing agreement. My peers looked up to me. Oh, I'm very interested in your research, sir. You must no doubt have offers from countless investors. So far be it for me to ask for a full collaboration, per se. I merely wanted to express my interest. No pressure at all, naturally. And the villains even began to fear me. Becoming Rawat showed me what a superficial world we live in. But I did not hold a grudge. After all, this superficiality could be made to work in my favor. Or so I thought. But alas, the world seemed bent on finding a reason to make me despise it. Mother, I'm back. How are you doing? You're not my son. I bought the best medicine Mora could buy, but nothing would cure her illness. In the end, I hoped she'd at least be able to see her son one last time before she passed, but when everyone else rejected me, the only person who cared about me was my mother. Then, when I became a rising star in the Fontaine Research Institute, I was unrecognizable to her. I have to let her see me again. Even if it means donning my own wretched, ugly face. Well, is that enough explaining for you? Now do you understand? Let me inside already! Have you ever considered if you'll even be able to look your mother in the eyes after what you've done? You found a way to completely change your identity. 
You could easily have escaped from them. But no. You chose to keep working with them. <laughs> Why would I want to give up on such a lucrative business? The profits were dozens of times that of the synth business, and it was all above board. So you kept being a villain just for the money? Villain? By what standard? Is doing evil deeds really what makes someone a villain in your eyes? Or does it all come down to the way they look? None of you saw a villain when I was wearing my other face, did you? You have no right to judge me! You're all just fake people living in a hypocritical world! I regret nothing! My mother would understand! You... You're a villain to the core! But especially that tongue! Honestly, I don't see a villain when I look at your current face either. Don't humor me. You don't seem surprised by my confession in the least. How long have you known the truth? I didn't know anything for sure until you chose to take that potion bottle and spare our lives. But if you're asking when I started suspecting you, it was the first time you came to see me at the infirmary. I had to confirm my suspicions. That's why I chose to join this investigation. Are you kidding me? A young promising researcher and a wretched criminal? What on earth gave you the idea that they could be one and the same person? Well, there were no visual clues. This potion's face-changing effects were very powerful. Even as a melazine, I couldn't see through the disguise. But I believe I understand humanity a little better than most of my kind. Humans have certain fundamental qualities that do not change with their appearance. Fundamental qualities, huh? So you think you're the one who's seen through me, do you? Most people probably don't know this, but I think I can guess what your deal is. Melazine constitutions are very close to that of water, so it stands to reason that the potion should work on them, too. You used it yourself, didn't you? That's why you have a human appearance. Sea Dream? Yes. You're right. <laughs> I'll bet it was back in the days when Melazines were discriminated against because of their appearance. It was either carry on living in the gutters as part of an alien race cast out by humanity, or become the head nurse of the Fortress of Meripede, revered by all. Not a hard choice to make. It's a no-brainer. So you see... You and I were the same. And I'm the one who saw through you. That's not important right now. You came here to see your mother, didn't you? Well, I can grant you your wish. Huh? A head nurse. I'm not sure that's a good idea in his current state. <laughs> Don't worry. Back in the warehouse when I traded the potion for our lives, I was doing it to test him. He was willing to risk sacrificing his only chance of escaping capture by opening the gate in exchange for the potion. All so he could see his mother again. If nothing else, his concern for his mother is genuine. I see. So before you arrest him, please allow him to see his mother one last time. The Traveler and I will accompany him. You have nothing to worry about. Alright. I understand. The story is good as fuck so far. And I really like the voice actor of the villain. He's absolutely amazing. Mom? It's me, Potten. Your son. You, you recognize me now, don't you? <coughs> Mom, what's wrong? I'm sorry. But I have some bad news. I examined your mother last time we were here, and it appears that due to her prolonged fever, she's lost her eyesight. What? Your appearance no longer has any bearing on her ability to recognize you. But there are always other ways to remind our loved ones who we are. Wouldn't you say? That's kind of fucked up. You could have no, no, said it before, be. man. Oh my god, it's Please, fucked Mom, up. Open your eyes. It's me, your son, Potten. If, 
If you really can't see my face, then here, take my hand. Tell me you feel your son's hand. Uh. I've done so much to get to this point. Please, you have to recognize me. <coughs> no, 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 no. The temperature of his palm must have changed. I'm sorry. It seems I couldn't bring him back to you after all. Oh, it's you. Thank you. Mom, why will you answer her and not me? Why? Why? No more questions, Potten. She's gone. Mom? Mom? I'm sorry to say this, Potten, but you and I are not the same. It was fucking amazing so far. I mean, now we'll come, we we'll get to the end, and then the wait is over, everyone. The sale of our new skincare product, Romaritime Essence, will now begin. Another skincare promotion, and it's selling as fast as last time. Mm, it's what people would think if they knew what was in the last batch. Oh, Sea Dream's here too. Because it's her thing. Hey, Sea Dream. You two got a good rest yesterday after all your hard work? Of course! Nurse's orders, right? Anyway, are you here to take notes for your next article? Actually, I'm mostly here to help Officer Morgan wrap up yesterday's case. Ah, that reminds Paimon. That stuff sold like crazy, didn't it? Is it gonna cause huge problems? Nope, there's nothing to worry about. Unless modified, Butterfly Dew is an excellent skincare product that's completely safe to use. Besides, officers have already retrieved all Butterfly Dew purchased on the market. Now it's just a matter of disposal. After consulting Monsieur Nervulet, I came up with a way to neutralize any harmful effects. So it'll evaporate naturally without polluting water or soil. That's good to you. It's Sea Dream to the rescue again! Thank you for serving as our consultant, head nurse. All the butterfly dew we recovered has been disposed of, according to your instructions. Great! Good job, everyone! Good job. Also, you mentioned you wanted a copy of Rawat's interrogation records. Well, technically, Potten's records. Anyway, I have them with me. Here. After he saw his mother for the last time, it was like all his mental defenses came crashing down. He put up no resistance during the interrogation, and answered all our questions. We learned a lot. Apparently, the formula was something he discovered by chance while helping the criminal gang produce synth. Later, he came up with the idea to dilute it, and use the resulting substance as a skincare product. Their supplier was Vache. Oh but no. But you could also argue that they Vache. were the ones doing him a favor. No. His operation helped Vache's gang dispose of an enormous amount of evidence. It made for a seamless collaboration. One man's trash was another man's treasure. And there were no loose ends. It's no wonder Vache. we never noticed what Potten's gang was up to. Vache again, huh? Oh no. Is there still no end to the harm he caused? <laughs> This motherfucker died like half Make a no fucking mistake. year ago. It's causing issues. Will come to an end. It's only a matter of time. 
Since the flood cut off their supply of primordial seawater, they've been forced to resort to riskier methods, like using their private reserve to attack people on the street. Naturally, those attempts all ended in failure. After receiving numerous reports, we were able to zero in on the gang and eventually round them up. That sounds more like it. Based on what he told us in his confession, we pretty much had him backed into a corner, even though he made a point of distancing himself from the gang while disguised as Rawat. He tried to throw us off his tail by reporting his accomplices, giving him enough time to transform back into Potten and see his mother one last time. But there was one thing he hadn't anticipated. Even though Potten had been missing for a long time, we were very much still on the lookout for him. So the moment he appeared in public after changing back to his original appearance, we caught him. So he tried this once before, huh? Guess he really did want his mother to see him again. But in the end... Looking it's kind of fucked up. Records, it seems like he spent the first sum of money he earned as reward on his mother's treatment. Yes. Which is why I suspect that his initial motive for using the potion was not personal greed, but a desire to become somebody who had the power to save her. Even so, he went too far. In the end, he got what he deserved. I understand. Thank you for bringing me these records. Why did you want them anyway? Potten was one of my patients, so I need to put together a medical file for him. My teacher always stressed that a person's life experiences are just as important to their file as their medical history. Why are you still treating him like your patient? Isn't he kind of beyond redemption now? Well, that may be true, but a patient is a patient, regardless of the choices that bring them to my care. Ah, one last thing, head nurse. Please keep everything you know about this potion a secret. Understandable. It would be for the best if most of Fontaine knows nothing of its existence. I know my fellow officers and I will be able to sleep easier if that's the case. Of course. Not to worry. <laughs> Thank you for understanding. I'll take my leave then. Yeah, fuck off, Morgane. So, Seedreen, did you really use that potion yourself? Why do you sound so surprised, Paimon? I told you all about it. It was quite a while ago now. Uh, you mean that story about the witch and the potion? So it was really actually. Wait, he said it's a, a true story. story. Why would she lie? Yes, it really actually genuinely was. But. The process of making the potion. I know. Uh, there are some secrets I can't tell anyone about. But considering everything we've been through together, I know I can trust you with them. Oh, God. Primo Seawater? Before I tell you, though, could you follow me somewhere? I want to pay my respects to an old friend. Of course. Time to go to the graveyard? Ah, that graveyard was close now. Now will be the last ending sentence to the story. For the people on two, I hope you enjoyed it. I know my um, screen is going to fuck up. My, my green screen right now. I still hope you enjoyed it. it looks not too terrible. Hope you have a nice day, my evening, whatever you have. Have a good one. Take care of yourself. Please follow too. subscribe. Hello. And yeah, eventually soon. Bye bye. Good to see you, traveler. Hi, mom. I trust all has been going well for you. Big news, everyone. The Udax is out of his office on important business. Hmm? Is that genuinely something people would consider big news? <laughs> Why wouldn't they? Important business is a big deal. Ah, yes, you're quite right. 
When someone you care about requires emotional support, being there for them at the right time and place is of the utmost importance. Most After reading important. the Marichal Say Phantom's reports, I had a feeling a trip here might be in order. Take note. That, my friends, is how Monsieur Nervillette shows that he cares. We're both here for the same purpose, actually. To accompany Sijuin as she pays her respects to her late teacher. So the old friend she mentioned was her teacher, then? The witch? Oh, uh, sorry, sorry. Paimon didn't mean to be rude. It's only because Sijuin calls her that all the time, so... I doubt she considers that title to be offensive, Paimon. Don't worry. Indeed. In fact, I believe Sijuin would take it as a sign of affection. She has spoken of this doctor on many occasions, and it sounds like she was a truly generous individual. In those days, many people harbored prejudices against Melusines. She was the only teacher willing to take Sijuin on as a student. Wow! <laughs> it's really nice of you two to be here for Sijuin. Guess you guys really look out for your younger colleagues, huh? Younger? Younger <laughs> colleague. Well, that might be true for the Udex, but I'm not sure I can say the same. <laughs> Uh. Sijuin served a sentence in the fortress of Meripede hundreds of years ago, and after she did her time, she decided to stick around. She's been an integral part of our administration ever since. Strictly speaking, the head nurse has been around longer than most people in the fortress, myself included. Pretty sure that makes me the younger colleague. She served a sentence? Probably yes. the face thing? Long before I became Udex, there was an ancient law in Fontaine that prohibited any attempt to transform another species into a human. There we go. Initially, I and most researchers believe this law to have been imposed due to ethical concerns. But now, it seems more likely that the law was nothing more than an insurance policy. A way for Egeria to ensure that her people would remain insulated from the truth, thus enabling them to lead more straightforward, happier lives. Ignorance is bliss, as they say. Sijuin had her reasons for choosing to obtain a human form, but the act was nonetheless in clear violation of the law. Could you tell us a little bit more about what happened back then? Please don't tell me movie time. I see what I'm Sijuin does not object to her close friends learning about her history. In fact, I first learned of it myself because she confessed the truth to me of her own volition. Oh. Movie time. I knew it, man. Even with their daughter oh, so ill, they kicked you out? <sighs> Stubborn as always. And prejudice isn't a disease I can cure either. <sighs> Shame that I don't have the energy to get over there. <sighs> You're laughable, you old witch. You want to save everyone in Fontaine, but you can't even save the patient before you. Master, what are you? I discovered a strange disease, one I suspect that every Fontanian suffers from. But without witnesses or proof, no one will believe me. I had no choice but to experiment on myself to find a cure. But I hit a wall. And as you can see, it took a wretched toll on me. Yeah, she has also fucked up face now. I'll find a cure for you. Then you can go cure her. There's no need. I am beyond saving now. There's nothing you can do. But, Master... As I said before, a doctor's duty is to treat whatever ailments they can. I know, but they don't trust me at all. <coughs> that girl. She's your first ever patient, isn't she? Tell me, what cost are you willing to bear to see her cured? Do whatever it takes. Even if it means breaking the law and being punished for it. 
As long as I don't hurt anyone. Yes. <laughs> Spoken like a true student of mine. Then I shall make one more final gamble. And see my experiment through to its end. Leave me for now, and come back in two hours. If I am able to work this miracle, then I will have found a way to save all Fontanians, and I shall be able to help you treat that girl. If not, then it means there is one more disease in this world that I cannot treat. In that case, do not come looking for me. I will leave you a parting gift. An accidental discovery happened upon through my study of this strange disease. It has little use, but it will at least help you cure this one patient you can reach. When Sijuin returned, the miracle had not occurred. She found a potion bottle and a note on the table. After using the potion as instructed, she gained her current form, breaking Fontaine's law in the process. And after I had confirmed the veracity of the events, I gave my verdict. So that's what happened. I fear Sijuin only understood the full story after the truth about the dissolution of Fontanians was uncovered. When I reflected on all this with that knowledge in hand, I felt a deep sense of regret. As I use the law to uphold justice, there are times when I cannot help but acknowledge its ruthlessness. After the final details of the events surrounding Sijuin's transformation came to light, I checked several sources and, thankfully, the legal code does not require Sijuin to shoulder any additional punishment. Hmm. Wonder how she feels about all this. Since she invited you here, I imagine she intends to speak of these matters with you, no? mentioned was my teacher when she passed her body was nowhere to be found all that's left of her is an empty tomb and even that's deep underwater now Sidwin, the witch who gave you the magic potion she was your teacher wasn't she <laughs> sounds like monsieur nervulet filled you in after learning the truth it must have been hard to process huh well, to be honest, after I realized what really happened that night, my first thought was that it kind of made sense. It seemed exactly like the sort of thing she would do. But she was planning to sacrifice herself and never told you! Well, yeah, because she wouldn't have accepted it. That's just who she was. If lying is what it took to get a kid to take their medicine, then that's what she'd do. A truly great doctor. All right. Why did you turn yourself in? Because that's only right. I broke the law. Simple yeah. as that. My teacher made her choice, and I made mine. True. It's just the way Potten framed it when he was asking you all those questions. It made Paimon really mad. You're not like him at all, and everything Nervalette said confirms that. And yet, you were still convicted and thrown in prison. It just feels so unfair. Unfair? I happen to think just the opposite. If I hadn't served that time, I'm not sure I would have been able to stay strong when he was questioning me. A second. Had to turn on lights. What makes you say that? I knew you'd be curious. Let me tell you a story.
the verdict came down. Why is it so lady? is guilty. The Udex defended the authority of Fontaine Law, but he did not confiscate the Melazine's medical kit. And so, the Fortress of Meripede gained a new little doctor. So cute. She still wore her hood and raincoat. Dude, oh, she needs it as a skin. It never rained in the fortress. It's so fucking adorable. Perhaps, thanks to her human appearance, no one refused her treatment. She treated more and more patients, and her sentence grew ever shorter. Finally, the people of the fortress could not live without her. And though her sentence ended, she did not leave them either. Then one day, she received an invitation from the outside world. The location seemed familiar, and when she arrived, an old lady was waiting for her. She saw right through the Melazine's disguise. But didn't reveal it. Instead, oh she asked no, a it's a best friend. Tell me, why do you think patient. you gained the respect of so many people, despite being a melazine? Because I look like a human. <laughs> it's been fifty years, Sijuin, and you haven't aged a day. I think everyone knows you are not human. I finally found you, after all these years. I still remember, you know. It was you who saved me that night. But... how? I was no longer a Melazine by then. Does it really matter if you're human or Melazine? <laughs> I remember the warmth of your palm. It's quite unmistakable. And you know what? It hasn't changed one bit. You don't have to hide anymore, Sijuin. These days, everyone wants to make friends with Melusines. And I think that it's all because of you. I'm sorry I couldn't say this until now, but... Thank you, Dr. Melazine. This is way too fucking wholesome, man. I can't. That's an ending I'm gonna about. cry, man. This is so good. After hearing everything Potten said, I wanted to tell him that it didn't matter who he looked like on the outside. But it was too late. The warmth in his palm had already disappeared. I tried to treat him, but the roots of his problem had nothing to do with his face. I understand. Thanks, you two. I appreciate you being here for me while I talk this through. Oh, it's nothing. Our pleasure. Oh, there's one more reason I invited you here. It's about time I finally give you what I promised. In order to restore the appearances of the face-swapping victims, the Marishose Phantom gave me special permission to make a few bottles of that potion. And I made one extra just for you two. Aww. Uh, we don't need it, though. Shouldn't we destroy it? Well, even if you chose to destroy it, I still thought I should give it to you first. You two did so much for me. How could I break my promise? Well, fair enough, but anyway, Hyman's definitely not interested in this stuff anymore. Just keep it as a souvenir, dipshit. If this is the very last bottle in all of Tevat, getting rid of it would feel like kind of a waste. Maybe we can give it a special meaning somehow. Oh, Paimon's got it! Melusine physiology wasn't affected by the Great Flood, right? So that means the potion should have a permanent effect on you! In that case, no, nah, she doesn't want between? to. Ever thought Definitely about transforming not. back to the way you used to look? No. After all, from a Melazine point of view, Paimon bets Melazines look the cutest of all. Paimon, after everything, do you really think it matters whether I'm Melazine or a human? Uh, well, 
What was Paimon thinking? You made up your mind a long time ago. Yeah, let's just destroy this thing. Leave it to me. She was amazing, man. So adorable, so wholesome, so well made. I'd like to stay here with my teacher for a little longer. I wish I could just give a head pat, man. Is Nivelletti and Ricey still here? If not, then I'll call it here. Yep. Once again, thanks for tuning in. Everybody, appreciate it. Hope it was enjoyable. Two bus, subscribe, please. Helps out, please. Come to my Twitch, say hello. And I would say bye, because it's late, man. It's it's very late, okay. Anyways, thanks for tuning in. Very much appreciate it. Hope you have a nice day, morning, evening, whatever the fuck you have. Hey, everyone, take care of yourself. See you in the next video, whenever. The